I get killed in the well, nether and I'm Encore cool. might have to carry in another interview. Yeah, I'm gonna carry an Equinox interview this time. Let's go. Yeah. Anyways, welcome to Andy's Meme Cast with your host, Andy. Hi. And your co hosts Encore. Yo, what's up? And Viz. <laughs> We're the best intros. Yeah, Viz already there with basically eating his microphone. <laughs> and um, what else would you do? This is episode three. Mm-hmm. Of course. Fun fact: now, this, reco- this was recorded before the first two episodes even came out. Totally. That's the best part about it, really. We're making an entire season and releasing it at the same time. <laughs> we're all just like shows. Yeah, we're making a show right now. It's yeah. like the good Netflix shows. All so we are. Just, we got realized. we got a bit on our agenda today, uh, and by a bit I mean one thing. Yeah. So really, we. Alright, I'll go. I'll go invite Equinox. Dang, I was thinking maybe we could talk a bit before, but all right, you know. Yeah, let's, all right. I mean, I would talk a little yeah. bit. Yeah, let's talk a little bit before we do that. Yeah. So, you know, let's, so um, let's, let's Chronic, Chronic, Chronic has had some stuff going on with him. His yeah. um, how do y'all feel about his new track release? Different. Uh, I liked new it. Track. I have not um, heard his new track. Hold on, wait. I must give my opinion. Hold on, wait. Just let's just play it, oh, yeah. Bro. In the middle. Moment. Hold on. We'll play the first up. eight seconds of it because I bet Chronic's gonna be pissed if he even watches like at all of this. Eh, it's whatever. I mean, it's. it's... So what? There's a lot going on with Chronic at the moment. Um. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot in um uh, in uh like the UTX server uh with uh, yeah this whole thing. His ETX server, a little thing with Miles. Um, no, not ETX. Him, him um, leaving ETX. Server. ETX community uh, server. Yeah. No, no, like the group ETX. He 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 left the group ETX. <laughs> I doubt it. No, you can literally look in the ETX like group server. Damn. Yeah, he has a and Uncle has a screenshot of him literally saying he leave, he left ETX. Mm. Imagine right. ETX could be Andy, oh. couldn't be Chronic. Right. I mean, he he vowed he apparently made a vow to never work with you again. And when I brought which, up that you were in ETX, he was just like, "Yeah, I'm gonna leave ETX now," which is like very stupid. He actually left. Like, mm-hmm. he actually did. It's stupid. That's stupid. I can. Chronic doesn't have the big brand. He has a small brand. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Like, like if get, you leave because someone's in the same group, that's just petty. I get that he doesn't want to work with me, like, so on a track ever again, but, like, it's ETX. You've got to at least put some respect with ETX. I don't even think he wanted to be in because, it to begin with, but... But, like, it was, Esquire, it was, like, Esquire's choice to even get him in in the first place, and... So the fact that he just left is kind of disrespectful. Because, you know, Esquire thought like he's good enough to be in, and so he let him in, and then he just leaves. Like, it's disrespect, bro. A little bit, a little bit, yeah. It's, I mean, Chronic, like, I I, I don't know. He, he, he hates you a lot. Apparently. I don't get why he hates me so much. Like, bruh, it's not even not even that bad. It's just um I don't know. He just he just literally just hates your music. I, I I've noticed like, a pattern with him that he doesn't yeah. like overrated people, but he overrates people. Yeah. Including himself to be honest. Well, quote unquote overrated in his eyes. Yeah. That's that's kind of what it is. Less overrated. Yeah. And it, overrated in it, his it's like it's if he fine. um he, he mainly focuses flow. Like if you have flow, you're yeah. instantly not overrated to him. Yeah. I have flow though. Yeah, but he just he he sees you with like four bars that don't have flow and instantly just just attacks them. Bruh. 
he really only looks at like performance, but not like anything else. Yeah. He doesn't really go deeper into a song. It's, it's yeah. kind of like crab generalizing my fucking bars. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, it really is. I'm speak- Which I kind of find it funny that like a whole bunch of people say Andy's overrated, but there's only a handful of people who disagree. But technically, he's not overrated. It's like eventually, if only someone Andy will be so. Like, everyone will hate someone because they're overrated, which makes them underrated. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's... It's weird. I'm just being overrated, so it's not like I care. Um, one thing... Um, on, <laughs> I guess on a sort of topic, not really on topic, but like... Um... Diss tracks in the ETX community <laughs> with diss tracks, yeah. It's very, like, very weird because there, now, there are people who will, who will challenge you, like, just, like, challenge you, say, alright, like, let's go. They'll challenge you to a diss battle and then they just won't. Jade. Jade, Jade, yeah, there, there are people now in the ETX community who just, like, challenge you to diss battle and then just don't. Or, like, actual beef. They just say they'll diss and then they just don't. Like, it's very odd that people like that. It's odd that people like that decide to be in a community that's literally mostly about diss tracks. Like, bruh. Yeah. I mean. Also, very off topic, but I kind of find it funny that, like, a whole bunch of people, um,. Mainly, uh, Bisk and, uh, his, uh, level of people. Uh, yeah. take the Googles seriously. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> if, like, he took, um, he took it seriously when, um, Lil Killy said he, he has his Addy. Yeah, Lil Killy was gonna pull up on Bisk and shoot him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's strange how the Beagles haven't been active lately. No, I mean, Lil, Lil Kelly has, has been. Like, yeah, Lil Kelly like, is starting is old. to, and Young Bands is dead. Young Bands, young bands no, Young Bands isn't dead. I've heard from him. He's just too busy. Uh, young Bands is in his sanctuary. Young Bands, uh, hop on a disc. Yeah, total world domination. Yeah, Bigo's uh, Bigo's group disc with two. We're gonna people. try to get the total world domination beat, and we're just gonna distort it to an ungodly level. <laughs> I wouldn't have that. Yep. Mm, I don't, since I didn't exist in 2019. That's true. You didn't exist. Also, speaking of Bisque, I wish Encore never made that tier list, because now he's rushing everything. I, listen, it was my honest opinion at the time. And, and now he just thinks you're going to automatically put him in um, C or B tier. Which is not true. I listened to his new track, like that he leaked me, like Rain or whatever. Uh, it could be worse, I guess. Crocs was trash. Half of it was off beat. Okay, the intro was garbage, but Rain is definitely yeah. like a slight improvement. And <laughs> this, uh, I gotta send you this, Andy. Hold up, okay. hold up. This is like important. So what? he was talk. Low Killy was talking to Bisk. Oh. Right. <laughs> Oh, you told me this. Kill- Lil Killy was talking to Bisk, and that's what happens. Bruh. Killy told, Killy told Eggplant, which Eggplant told me about this. Bruh. Eggplant's pretty cool, not gonna lie. Yeah, he's cool. Let's just piss him off. And he kind of bad ass, to be honest, on your level, and then Bisk just says, yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> it was because um, it was because you were taking fucking... you were you took five days on the feature, which was taking like two months on my but whatever, whatever. You were taking it's... five days, and that's too long for him. I won't be surprised I, if I'm this just, album comes out I'm... before the end of the year. Yeah. It will. Point. I'm I'm just I'm just like I'm just I'm just working on stuff, you know. And also, I'm kind of sick right now, so that's also sure. another part of it. So. He, he doesn't get the verses take more than five seconds to make. I would have recorded it yesterday, but, like, I was sick. And I still am sick. So, like, how am I supposed to record it? 
Yeah. Like, I can do this only because, you know, I don't have to talk the entire time. Although we do talk for, like, four hours. Yeah, but <laughs> then we don't talk for, like, the entire time. Yeah. It's it's pretty chill. It's just a nice way to waste four hours. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of, when are we getting the uh, interview? <laughs> like, in, I want to carry it now. <laughs> What? I'm impatient. I want to do it in like half no. an hour. That's like seven for me, eight for Encore, uh, six yeah. for Andy. Yeah. Andy's stupid and lives in the past. No. Did you know that at yeah. 8 p.m. you're going to be like how, um, I like how I'm, uh, last, uh, podcast, uh, it was Andy's podcast, but he was <clears> the most <throat> inactive on it. <laughs> yeah, he talked the least on his own podcast. <laughs> Well, to be fair, I was focused on Minecraft. Minecraft's pretty good. I was focused on funny block game, alright? Like, I didn't funny block, block game is pretty good. funny, not gonna lie. Yeah. But I died in it, so it's the worst game ever. I hate it. And you're also the worst rapper ever. No one likes you. Bad, <laughs> overrated, <laughs> trash. Restricted you're podcast right. said so. Restricted podcast yeah. is always right. In reality, Strict can we talk dick. about... In reality, though, can we just, like, actually talk about how... Um, just the fact that like everyone, um, da, 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 da. a lot of people, quite the amount, decide to say that I'm trash now. Like there was a it's, period it's, where like, most of them aren't better than you. Difference, like difference. Everyone thought I was good. Like difference dropped. I was good. And now people just say, uh, yeah, he's bad. The like, Griffin shop, people thought it was good, then some people said it was bad, and then everyone followed. Yeah. Well, see, it's because Niblo said it. Niblo has become the king. Niblo really And people were scared to go by an opinion that isn't Niblo's, or that he will Probably. exile them. Yeah. What would you say is the best in the community now that Niblo left? I don't know. Oh, yeah, Niblo left. Um, it's really up to Oh, no. I mean... Sin was Going artist-wise, I guess now Miles. I would say maybe Miles. Maybe Miles. I don't know. Going rap-wise, uh, definitely yeah. Snowball. Oh yeah, yeah. Going rap-wise, I guess we have to go with uh, Chronic since he's like the only uh, one that like he's like the only good person that raps now. Nah, bro, and, Cosmo. Uh, no. No. <laughs> yes, Cosmo. Motherfucker man got breast cancer. Yeah, he's a yes. man who got breast cancer, bro. That's such a bar. That's a bar, Like, it's bro. so yeah. emotional. Yeah. I love how he's a man with breast cancer. What does man want to shit? So emo, but also, but also such a good diss. It was almost as emo as, like, Lil' Killy songs. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Lil' Killy. Lil' Killy made a song about not, not being able to fuck bitches. No, damn. Yeah, Lil' Killy made a song about how he didn't have money, so he couldn't fuck bitches. Damn. So sad. It was pretty... It, I related to it, because I was in that situation about, like, eight years ago. Damn. So... Also, uh... All right, you go. You go. Oh, or die. Who? And Corey, he was talking, and then I was talking. So... Yeah, shut the fuck up! Damn. Damn. <laughs> Yeah, I can't believe Lil' Killy would actually do that. When I was seven years old, I didn't have any money, so I couldn't fuck any bitches that day. This it was very... It was very... <laughs> how, old, how old is Killy? Oh, how old is Killy? Um, he's 17. He's 17. Damn. That's why he sounds like he's he's seven. Because he's 17. Yeah. yeah. Seven is silent. Right after 10. When you become 10, the age just loops back doesn't yeah, know what to do. The system just overflows. Yes. Yeah, he's 17, Um, and he was going to pull up. Get, like, here's the thing. Bisque was talking about how if he's really young, he's not going to pull up. But if he's really old, that's creepy. So I, so he had to he had to be an age that wasn't creepy. Bruh. 69. <laughs> that would make it seem so fake. Like, why would a 69-year-old be rapping about fucking bitches? Then <laughs> <laughs> would with sound five. That's true. I mean, Lil' Killy's pretty fire, if we're, if we're being honest. Yeah. Definitely the best Bigo, just because he drops the most. Yeah. 
Egg, uh, Eggplant is the worst because he has the least. Well, he has two verses and one's already deleted. Eggplant. I, yeah, still have, I still have the death track with like all those people. But like, Young Bands is already an EP and a collaborative EP down. Like Young Bands ain't that, ain't doing that bad. Yeah. Yeah. I bet he's working Eggplant on a big worst. project right now. Ooh. Ooh, he's gonna Low Kelly's it. working on a full length album. It's about like thirty four songs. <laughs> Damn. He's really putting the grind in, and he's gonna he can have a, a huge like versatility on it. Like there's gonna be about like eight emo songs. Damn. And there's gonna be like ten hype songs. Will there be <laughs> any disses? Most definitely. Most definitely. Um. Like, probably, even the emo songs are probably going to be disses. Yes! Yes! <laughs> because he's obsessed with dissing people. I'm pretty sure he's thrown shots in every single song he's made. Bruh. Um. Bruh. Is this, is this podcast just going to be about the Beagos? No. Yeah. I, really I don't do. think there's enough to talk about there's for the not, Beagos. There's not, there's not enough to talk about with the Beagos. To be we talk about how Zayer doesn't know that like ev- not everyone's gonna like um, songs that his friends and him make. Yeah, Zayer, Zayer kind of like, stupid. Wait, Zayer like, makes I, uh, songs still. Yeah. But uh, um, he commented on my um. He replied to my comment on Crocs song, saying. Um, calling me a hater, and I just say I'm sorry. I have an opinion, and he's like, "Okay, but still keep it to yourself. You don't know. You don't understand how much this can hurt people." I like how I like it when people say that, especially to commentary YouTubers. Like, bitch, the entire point of the video is to express their opinion. Is the person yeah. expressing their opinion, and you're saying that they have to keep their opinions to themselves? Their entire thing is just expressing opinions. <laughs> expressing opinions, yeah. Yeah. And also, Zaire Zaire kind of has yeah. the dumb. Yeah, and like he get he got like pissed off. I mean, when uh, where is it? Yeah, when I commented on his Kelly disc. His Kelly disc was pretty fire. It was it was ass. It was fucking terrible. <laughs> yeah. Had a good beat though, which makes me sad. He was gonna use the beat for a diss on you, but apparently his brother deleted the, the diss. Uh... <laughs> his brother's a savage. It wasn't gonna do much. it wasn't gonna do anything anyway. Straight up I still, savage. I still won with an ass verse on um uh whatever the thing is called. Six seconds of hell. No, it's gonna um, caught in the web, and then those ver- those fire short disses. Those fire <laughs> three three second long verse. Yeah, and um, my fourteen second diss track. Yeah, but like, can we all admit the two bars in Sunnen is kind of fire? Yeah, destroyed him. <laughs> <laughs> destroyed him with two bars. Two bars. Yeah, but like, Sunnen. okay, I commented on um uh, Zaire's thing, um, saying it was bad multiple times. Uh, you commented about 18 times and you did all but one. One, two, three, four, five times. And he just got pissed off at me. It's like saying, oh, all I do is post hate. Which, you know, you no. Know, isn't true. Uh, and then he says, like, yes, you do, dumbass. Every time I post, it's always hateful. <laughs> yes, because you're terrible. And then his cousin, what was it, his brother? Uh, it was his cousin. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, his cousin was like, "You should really give him credit. He he, he keeps trying to do. It. He keeps trying his best, unlike you ever did." Yeah. And it just kind of proved him wrong with saying, uh, "I am me making two albums." Yeah, you kind of have two albums so, on the way. Which, yeah. by the way, why are you procrastinating so much on your first one? What do you mean? You've procrastinated so much on one album that you're working on a completely different one. To avoid <laughs> working on the first one. <laughs> like, how much of a procrastinator do you have to be 
to be like, <laughs> I have this album in progress. Let's start a different album so I don't have to work on it. Bruh. <laughs> better start a third. Uh, better start a third album. Yeah, and I work on an EP in the middle of working on the album. Bruh. Yeah, and then you make an EP. That's just procrastinating more. Yeah, he, <laughs> he just doesn't want to work on coming up. <laughs> he would rather do anything else. Like this podcast. <laughs> now I realize that I just kind of don't like a lot of the songs for coming up, but I'm still posting them because why not? Damn. Well, there's there's a lot of songs you do like, right? There's like two. Bruh. Uh, changes and regrets, I'm guessing. <laughs> what? Changes and regrets, I'm guessing. Oh, no, 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 no there's three. There's three there. Changes, regrets, right and don't right give now. a shit. No. Don't give a shit was okay, but Damn. it was kind of like just uh, like just showing a vibe. This is the wrong really per- This is the wrong time to be talking about don't give a shit negatively. Damn. I like Dandy's verse though. I did like it. Hate is addicted to me like a dick. <laughs> Hate is addicted to me. Uh, Miles, didn't like Miles didn't like your verse though. Miles didn't like my verse. Of course he did. Yeah, he's like. Yeah, cause no, he didn't like how he liked how it sounded. He just didn't like the whole like thing of it. Like you talked about haters, cause apparently now that's all you do. Bruh, I don't though. <laughs> I have Not sure posted if he was serious, it. Though, so don't, don't take my opinion. I thought you. I'm, did. I'm pretty sure you didn't only talk about haters for your verse on Mysterious. You uh, you you did talk about them for a little bit, but you had like other topics in there. Oh yeah, Mysterious. Uh, yeah. If you guys don't know, I have. I'm a rapper. No, he isn't. Whoa. Damn. He's a no, capper. Right. Let's see how many, artists that raps. Let's see how many uh-huh. songs of on which I've talked about haters. Um, haters are dick to me like. Haters are dick to me like an alcoholic. It was one on one on the isolation album EP. Uh, uh, one on the isolation EP. That's what it's called, not album. Idiot. Mm-hmm. Six songs or whatever. Um, Six songs in the uh, EP. Yeah. There might be like one or one or one or two maybe on the on um, um, difference. Um, I don't see. Let's see. Yeah, that's like the only recent ones. Those are the only recent songs. Oh, Let me look on difference. Most people want to count them. Uh, all the re-uploads that don't give a shit recent. Yeah, um, counting that, you have about, like, 50 songs that you talk about your haters. <laughs> no, 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 um, Crab got skeptical about changes, so he's, he just thought it was a don't give a shit re-upload. <laughs> Maybe it <laughs> is. No, exactly, it actually wasn't, but, you it's, know, it was a real song. on my channel. Hold up, so how many songs do you talk about haters? One? Um. And then? Like, one, two. Technically, one for the Gooba remix. But that's not on difference, right? Wait, is it? No, it's not. Yeah, fuck you. There's, there's you can't take my word on anything. I thought um, Andy this trend on whack. <laughs> I just yeah. Juf. Yeah, a little juice. To be honest, though, it did kind of fit Trent. <laughs> but it didn't, because I didn't even know his age. Yeah. How how was my remix of uh of Frozen and Traps? How was that? Uh, oh, yeah, that was don't fire. care. It it really like the two songs blend together really well. Mm. Oh yeah, I forgot that um uh, Zaire's cousin responded to my um comments the, saying uh, I need Jesus. The only times I've talked about my haters was yeah. like twice total, and even yeah. then. One of them, technically th- four, I mean, like, technically three, three, but technically four, because one song on, um, Isolation EP, um, uh, I don't, don't give a shit, and then the Gooba remixes, which there was supposed to only be one of, but the, but I thought the Gooba remix didn't save, so I made another one, and then it turned out that they both saved, so I made two for no reason. Well, wait, again. but also, um, also, well, didn't you talk about haters and broken? They um, see me on the actual. I mean, I, I kind of did, but I was more talking about the community. I, I think. 
Yeah, like that community as a whole. Yeah, I wasn't really talking about haters at that. I was just talking about the community as a whole. Haters are addicted to me like a dick. You addicted to dick like a stick. Haters are addicted to me like a fucking alcoholic. Da, 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 da. I should do a Don't Give a Shit remix. This year? Yes. It's gonna be fire. Don't worry. Should I? I want to make um don't give a shit, but it's off beat. But I can't do it because um Andy's verse was Everyone's down with, with the beat. Damn. Damn. Can you just like chronic gonna sing it's off beat anyways? So. Andy, can you send me your verse acapella? Uh, I can try. Yay! Now I can make it slightly off beat. You know what you should do? You should make um. Uh, I don't know. We'll get Damn. ready, because that's going to be my content from now on. Just just slightly offbeat songs and nothing else. Just only only good songs. I'm going to make them offbeat. Bruh. Don't that's give a shit isn't good. It has ND on it. Yes. Facts. Or my, or my songs are just songs that I like. It's not necessarily big good songs, just songs that I think are good. Well, you have terrible takes. You like ND. Damn. I never realized how much bad ta how bad of a taste um Trent and uh Crab had until I saw their comments on Bisque songs. Yeah. Mm. Bisque is just interesting. And he has Killy on his album. I like your voice. Even though we were in, like, <laughs> in the middle of beef. I've, I I start looking at the comments on Waitin' Alone because it was a while ago and I see a comment from four months ago that says I like your voice no hetero <laughs> <laughs> damn <laughs> oh yeah can we talk my fan base has become really weird as of Reese as of yeah I can recent. tell as it's become more Are... as it's become larger it's become weirder and by that isn't I like 80% of your fans female uh yeah and like at least five percent of that is simps and people who like my voice apparently i mean it doesn't seem like that bad of a gig you get a bunch of simps i mean yeah but i don't want simps you, you can be pokimane for a day i mean i i like simps but like i don't want <laughs> it's just sound really weird but like i like simps but i don't want simps this is a simp for you, because he's stupid. I'm reading the, um, uh... You can simp for me, the just comments not off of hard. Stuck. Uh, one person says, You are way too good at rapping and singing. You should be on trend. What? Yeah. Uh, that's nice. That is very nice, uh, comment. A fun fact about most of my fan base: They know nothing about my music. It's very... Very funny that they don't because like I they, they like so you for much. your videos on XX Mocha Coffee Latte. <laughs> XX Latte. I mean fuck. Yeah, X, 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 X Latte. <laughs> <laughs> X Latte X. Yeah. I fucked up the coffee joke and said XXX. Why did like, you get Tentacion. Why did you come to shut up when I said I get major I lost track vibes from this song? That's me. <laughs> Because fuck that. Fuck music. Andy's music is terrible. Damn. No. Yeah, I because just, it's Andy. I just thought it would be funny that I told <laughs> that I told you to shut up, and you made it funnier by just putting it into sad face. <laughs> <laughs> you said I am getting okay. major. I've lost track vibes from this song, and I said shut up, and you just put sad face. <laughs> Hey, did I just put sad face? Yeah, you just put, like, a sad face. I mean, it seems like something Viz would do, because he's a simp for you, for bad music, like, indie music. <laughs> just do I should probably shut up now. And then someone just says, a body has been discovered. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I saw that comment. Funny. <laughs> also, I'm slightly triggered that um, your all of my lo-fi music playlist doesn't have your EP on it. Damn. Wonder why. Cough, cough. Wait, I want to go look at that because of me. It's because of me. I forced Andy to not put his EP on there. Damn. That sucks. Oh, I saw the, I saw the thing from four months ago. 
I like your voice, no head room. There's a lot of dislikes because this guy is an ex Mocha X hater. I'm not a hater. Wait, what's what video is that? That's on the stuck. It's a reply, and I was reading it, and I've just got to say mm. this right here, right now. I'm not an ex Mocha X hater. I don't hate ex Mocha X. I just don't like the fact that she's as popular as she is with the content that she's making. The content that she's making is so subpar and basically bad. My shit posts are funnier than her content. Like it's And it's, aren't they all like under twenty seconds? Most yeah, of the time? like pretty much all of them are under twenty seconds, except for like She makes like a video every hour and they're all like under twenty seconds. She makes like five videos every hour and then just like five videos all in one hour, and then just... And they all get, like, 50,000 views, too. Yeah. Why? Like, yeah, like, five... Wait, hold on. Let me see how many uh, they made today. Yeah, like, five yeah, within, like... Five yes. within a couple of hour. Five hour. within a couple of hours. Sorry. Five hour. within a couple of hours. Like, th yeah, five within a couple of hours, and then just, like every single day like how how do you even do that like how do they even get views because that's like not with the algorithm so two days she made 11 videos two days ago within two days ago she has made a lot of videos but like two days ago on the all in one day she made 11 one, two, which three, four, why five, six and just seven, today, she's nine, made ten, five. Eleven. Yeah, why eleven? Eleven. And just today, she's five, made five. Eleven. That's five, four. So that's twenty-one videos. Why that many in two days? I get they're short, but like, damn. She has to keep feeding her five-year-old fans content. And the, and the longest is a minute. Yeah. Five. Out of your there's, there's, did Encore just say be right back? Cringe. Leaving in the middle of a podcast? Cringe. L. Why does she cringe. have 40k subs? I don't know why she has 140k. Over 84 million views. 84,000 subs. I mean, 140,000 subs. Sorry. Don't know how to read. 140,000 subscribers and like there shouldn't be that many subscribers because like you know yeah it's it's not that good it's not it's, it's not it's not good it's like i get it it's your taste in comedy or whatever but like it's how many just, videos does she have like I get that it's the person's taste in the comedy or whatever, like, yeah, whatever, but, like, I don't get why. Loud Oxley equals 20. Like, if she had, like, less subscribers, like, again, like, I'm still whatever about it, but, like, I'd be more whatever about it if she had, like, a reasonable amount like 20k to like 50k and not 140 yeah. fucking thousand with 80 with 84 fu million views yeah like i don't think that deserves that many for fucking like <laughs> oh, the most of the contents not even 20 seconds so why the fuck is she getting yeah. 40 like 40 70k 100k like a video This, and especially with the Every Gay Gotcha Love Story video, that one has 400,000 views. Why? I don't know, but, like, they just may sit off of, like, like, even when it was made, it was irrelevant. And people just oh. like to say that the Gotcha, Gotcha, Gay Gotcha Love Story videos are bad and overly sexual because that's not accurate to real life when me someone who has been in a gay relationship has very much had that my relationship be like that so that's very much still realistic and people just refuse to admit that 
sometimes sexual, overly sexual relationship is real. And bruh, I'm crying. It's the most popular video. I want to watch this. See what this is about. Why, like, mm, this just, like, doesn't make any sense. These videos are Why just... does that have 600,000 views? Look at chat. What, what chat? No, I have to take a mad shit. Damn. But these these videos just do not deserve to be this. Our most just... popular video, I just watched it and I regret it. And I didn't get a single thing. Like, I get it's your, like, I get that people can enjoy and laugh at the video. At her videos. Yeah, whatever. But, like, damn. It, the, the comedy. Like, I don't, I'm not just saying, oh, I don't like the comedy. It's not my taste when I say it's bad. I say it's bad because it's not properly structured comedy. Like, with mine, there's at least setup and a punchline, but with hers, there's punchlines and no setups. And it's some, of the, yeah. and oh, some wow. videos, and like most of the videos, because they're so short, are exclusively punchlines. Like, pretty much every single video is a punchline. Like, they're all like taken from short clips, short clip videos or whatever, and like. They're just not good. Like, they're... They're... Like, short videos can have setup and punchline, but... Ones that... Like, the ones that X, Mo, uh, X puts her characters over... And, you know, ones that were originally made... Ones that are originally made by X, Mocha X... Just, like, have just punchline and no setup and real, just, like... Oh, okay, there's a, like, most jokes so have, cool. most jokes have, like, a non-obvious setup, and, like, then there are others that just, like, X Mocha X ones that just don't have setup, and it's like, bruh. Why? I can't wait for, like, that one X Mocha X fan to uh, watch this whole podcast. Yeah, watch the whole podcast. One. I'm that one X Mocha X fan, by the way. Damn. Oh. Damn. X Mocha X is just way overrated. Yeah. I can tell by watching that one video. Like, these, these, but because it's funny gotcha community, they just say, oh, yeah, she made video on gay gotcha life, on gay gotcha videos, on gay gotcha stuff stuff on gay gotcha love stories and makes funny haha short videos that i can take like five seconds watching so like subscribe she is very good i did did, 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 did. like bruh just because she made a video on gay gotcha love stories doesn't mean they're accurate like there are there is a large amount of them a large amount of gay gotcha love stories that aren't sexual and people only like to poke fun at the sexual ones because oh they're totally overly sexual Ugh. like but like bruh it's youtube fuck you expect and also they like to get out them because apparently they're not accurate but again they are it's just that in real life they're more rare but still that doesn't mean that they don't happen yeah it's very stupid. X Mocha X is not a good YouTuber, in case you couldn't already tell by the way I'm speaking. How dare you? <laughs> Don't care. X Mocha X is the best gacha tuber ever. <laughs> Cap. She inspires me to take my daily shit. <laughs> like. <laughs> All I heard was just lag daily. I'm gonna take my daily shit. Yeah, that sounds like it. Sounds like you, Viz. Yep. Yeah. Somehow I live farther away from Encore than you do, and yet somehow 
I can hear him better than you. Yeah, yeah I, just, I think you're just stupid. I don't know how this works, but it does. <laughs> okay. I, bet I, I can name this state right now. I know exactly where Viz lives. No, you don't. Alaska. Damn. Oh, how did you find out? It was pretty obvious. I mean, it didn't snow. You're just covering up the fact that it did. No, stop. You're being mean. And you know something else? What? You live at the top of Alaska. <gasps> How did you find out? Uh, I found your Addy. You tried and gave me it. No way. Apparently you and Trent had some uh, fun times together. And no. so he knows your Addy. Why, why is that a thing? I have no clue, but like I know your Addy now, and I'm going to pull up. I'm pretty, sure, like Andy for I'm pretty sure Exidy made that a thing. Mm-hmm. Now that I'm now that I'm looking at people, like um, <clears throat> let me just da 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 da. Now Fuck. that um now that um peace out gotcha opinions is blown up, there are a lot more people that are basically making videos just like peace out gotcha opinions videos, and yet somehow. Mine are still the most relevant, I guess. Mine are just the more watched ones, I guess. Cause yeah, fuck that's you. a good. Because fuck you, I'm Andy. I'm actually funny. Haha, ha, XD. You can be funny, but you're a bad rapper. Your Cap mother. Rapper. Your mother. Oh. Ooh, okay, yeah. Andy kind of got you there, Encore. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of people that just like to just want to be exactly like peace out gotcha opinions but you know they're they're just not it like like you can talk about the gotcha community like if you're a gotcha person talking about the gotcha community you can talk about it all you want but like just it doesn't work out it just won't work out because you look like a copy I'm currently dying. That's so now epic. I'm gonna, now I'm gonna go make three videos talking about the gotcha community. Gotcha and community. Then get, and then I'm gonna get mad when I don't get three thousand views. Fun fact about gotcha community: gotcha community commentaries and not gotcha commentaries. Gotcha commentaries are different from gotcha community commentaries because gotcha, gotcha community commentaries are purely about. Um, uh, Let's see. They're purely about oh, the gotcha community is overly gay, cringe. It's bad. Overly gay. Overly sexual. Overly sexual. And it's for some reason it's also gay. Not a just a coincidence. I swear. Like, I like how people specifically pick on the gotcha life gay love stories and not the sh not the normal love stories that are just the exact same as the gay ones like there's real homophobic vibes coming from just that alone like why would you make it just about the gay love stories i'm in pain that's cool encore no one cares though this is podcast all right you want to go uh invite uh equinox now encore well, i'm not i'm not done taking my mad shit yet <laughs> wait you're doing this mid podcast yes i have to when nature calls you gotta answer my guy uh, i am slightly disturbed it's fine <laughs> <laughs> i'm slightly disturbed <laughs> You don't gotta be slightly disturbed. It, just, just act like I'm just sitting in my room. Yeah. Uh, it's also people just. Anyways, people just really want to be like, peace out, gotcha opinions, and like, yes, I get it, peace out, gotcha opinions, very good YouTuber, but like, peace out, gotcha that? opinions, you, peace out, gotcha opinions, basically, gotcha person who makes videos about gotcha commentary person who makes well communities on gotcha commentaries on gotcha thing 
and they're how I got so, and they're basically where my first base, where my burst of just popularity came from. Because I made a video with them. Wow. Am I friends with them? Uh, no. I, I know them, but I'm not friends with them. Yet. Um. I'm lucky that, like, there are just some people that, like, there's a lot of the people that, um, uh, a lot of the people after the collab with me that, um... Alright, oh, you can do your thing now, I'm done. Shut up. I'm still not done. Peace out. A lot of the people <laughs> after that, that Peace Out Gotcha Opinions collabed with after, okay. after they collabed with me, just, like, a lot of the people that are in the collabs are very much just the same and like okay like yeah that was that felt like peace out gotcha opinions but like just more uninteresting that's epic and that's basically all they are they just feel like blatant carbon copies <laughs> meanwhile i managed to Fish, shut the fuck up yeah viz all right now you can invite him Alright, I'll go I like how no one likes to comment on my comment on my stories and stuff because they have no idea about it. Woo. Yeah, we don't we don't even know what you're talking about, stupid fake rapper. No, you do. Uh, uh, no one no one likes you, Viz. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, boy, Viz. Viz now. Yeah, fuck you. I was even talking. I was eating a cookie. <laughs> Quit eating Man, cookies, We don't care. Ass. That's fucking weird. Who eats cookies? Who eats <laughs> cookies in 2020? Cringe. Merk! Fat. Kinda racist, not gonna lie. Fuck you. Fat. Fuck you. Fucking no, no. weird. <laughs> no, you fucking fat ass, fucking, fucking cookie eater. <laughs> fucking weird ass. Fucking what? <laughs> What if um, someone just randomly just, just um joined the VC? That would be kind of weird, especially considering the only people here are us and Equinox. Yeah. Yeah. Someone just, someone random just hacks in. <laughs> yeah. What if someone named Equinox just hacked into the VC? Yeah, that'd be pretty weird. I'm not gonna lie, it would be kind of weird. Okay. So um, the guest is going to be in VC and like. Uh, an amount of time. I, fuck you. Get ready for. I need to say Shut nothing. Me to say barely, barely anything, and be ready for Encore to carry a whole ass interview again. And this time I'm not tired, so I'm probably going to carry it a lot more. <laughs> <laughs> uh, shut the fuck up, Viz. And also, the guest is yes. taking slightly longer than our last one did. So now we just kind of have to stall time here and wait for them to join i'm just gonna tell you guys right now you're gonna have to talk for a little bit while i think of my million questions no uh, fuck you fuck you viz no fucking, you you're fucking baby you are a fucking baby your mother i'm eating a cookie i don't care about your fucking cookies you're so weird you have a cookie fetish or something i think you do <laughs> all you do is eat cookies like that's kind of weird bro yeah. Like, are you sane? are you saying? No. Damn. Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, fuck you, Viz. Yeah, fuck you, Viz. Fuck me. All my homies, homies hate, hate Viz. Viz. All my homies hate Viz. Not gonna lie. All my homies hate Viz. All my homies. Wait. Hate Viz. <laughs> Don't question it. My it's part of the bit. All my. All my homies fucked Viz. Not gonna lie. It's all at the same time, too. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I'm not laughing at that. I'm just, like, laughing at the fact that you said, all oh, my homies fucked Viz, and then he just goes, munch, munch. <laughs> <laughs> Viz starts eating the cookie. <laughs> yeah, this fucking weird cookie fetish is getting the better of him. He's, he's gonna Shush. become a cookie. Shush! No, he's no you. a cookie tomorrow morning. No, you. I'm not gonna be a cookie. Tomorrow I like morning. To play death, 
Does you probably oh. have a name that starts with? Oh, oh my god! Oh hey, hi, hi, Alexa, Hello there. Alexa, ah. We're just gonna mute him for now. Um, yeah. So <laughs> Equinox. Thing. Yes. Hello. Oh damn! You're a lot louder than these other two. Damn. It's. Um. So... I, have, I have no idea why. <laughs> because your mic is better. Fair um, yeah, that'll do it. Viz is not happy. Viz is unhappy. I'm... Wow. Uncore is at two hundred percent, and he's like significantly less loud than Equinox. Equinox. Is I'm not even using my music mic. I'm using just my computer mic. Oh god. <laughs> Viz is angry. Hold on. Yeah, Shut up, Viz. Angry. <laughs> 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 muted him. <laughs> yeah, I unmuted him just to tell him to shut up and then muted him again. Anyways. I don't think he's very happy. <laughs> I don't think he is. Anyways, um, we should probably start talking to Equinox now. So, who wants so, to f ask the yeah, first Equinox question? Equinox is here. Equinox. I am probably here. Viz. So, this is an interview, right? That's basically all, right. all it Viz. is. Go ahead, ask the first question. It's an interview. Uh, God, you got the guess and you can't even ask a question? Crazy. <laughs> you got like 10 minutes of being muted, bro. Yeah. Ask yeah it's a fucking guess. Question. You guys ask questions. Bruh. So, so, Equinox, um, so where do you think your music's going to be going within the next year? Do you think it's going to change at all? Uh... I mean, I'm definitely going to be experimenting with a bunch of new styles. Uh, I know I've mentioned before that me and uh, me and Lynx have an EP coming out. We're actually working on uh, three different EPs together. That uh, they're all very different styles. So the first one that we're doing later this month is just a very like it's just basic rap you know it's like what we normally do and then the uh the next one's gonna be like very uh very mainstream like pop type stuff and then the third one's gonna be kind of more like i don't know almost like a uh, cross between like nf and brother lynch hung you know very like dark horror core type sound so yeah we're just gonna be having a lot of fun with music and i'm like Personally, I'm experimenting with, like, electronic dubstep sounds, so my music is definitely going to be changing genres wildly through the next year. All right. Um, so what's your opinion on, um, on like, uh, Trip's community overall? Uh, that is a good question, because I know they're, like... There are people in there who definitely have potential. Uh, I just, uh... I don't know. It's very, uh... It's like... There's a lot of drama in the community that I don't really want to be a part of. It's, it's a kind of a mixed bag, you'd say, at least in terms of, like, people as an artist. Yeah, as artists, it's a very... It's a mixed bag because there are some people who are pretty good and some people who just need work. Um, and then obviously the drama, which, yeah, there's a lot of that. I've noticed. Yeah, and I'm I'm just not not about that. That's not a thing I usually participate in. Um, so how do you feel that, I'm pretty sure, tr wait, did Trev notice that you dissed him on his own cypher? Uh, I mean, I don't I think so. Uh, I didn't hear anything I, about it. I know, I know Lynx rewrote his verse to make it, like, a lot more obvious that he was not happy about, uh, just the entire process of the cypher. Like, he literally, like... I had lines in there that were kind of just like addressing like every community I'd interacted with at that point as a whole, like 
like especially the line like i'm not your producer and i never at your beck and call because like a lot yeah. of people were, were like just coming to me like oh hey can you do this can you do this can you do this and i'm like dude i'm my i'm my own artist i also have stuff to do like there are some people like uh i don't know if you know who uh tommy guns or neb are but I they're like them. yeah yeah they're like really really professional and they're like they can get that stuff hammered out like almost instantly if you need them to but like it like it actually like takes time for me because i'm i've been doing this for a while but i'm still new at it and i'm still learning stuff so it's harder for me but like uh like i just had like very not exactly subliminal, but just like, I guess you would say like general warnings for everybody. And then Lynx was just like, everybody else on this cipher is just a noise. And now I'm annoyed. And I'm like, that's, that's almost a bit too direct for me. Yeah. But uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. We just had you, fun with it though. You and Lynx seem like a pretty, like, like kind of like a dynamic duo. Um... I mean, obviously, you know, three EPs and both on the same verse, like both basically doing a collaborative verse on that cipher. Um, where do you think Lynx is going to go as a solo artist? I think as a solo artist, Lynx might actually, actually not even might actually, is probably going to be bigger than me just because he has a very, like, he has more mainstream appeal than I do. Plus, he's already, like, the thing about Lynx that I don't have, uh, like, and it's not even, like, music-wise, it's just personality-wise, is if he wants something, he will just ask for it. Whereas I am kind of, like, I feel like I have to earn stuff and, like, approach it. So, like, we're, uh, we're both working on a project with uh, Tommy Guns. And uh, Lynx has, like, two songs out, and then the third one he just put out uh, already has a Tommy feature. And, like, I would kill for a Tommy feature, and I'm sure if I asked him to, he would say yes. Actually, I'm pretty sure he said, if you guys ever want a feature, I would say yes. But I feel like I have to get better musically in order to earn a Tommy feature, you know? Like, he's better at just going to people and being like, Hey, can you do this? You're and not really I, like afraid for afraid of no. Yeah. All right. Like um, he he's just better at putting himself out there, and I'm not. Okay. Okay. Um. This is a question I asked um the other person I interviewed. But uh, who in like the Airhola uh, community, I guess ChipVZ's community, uh, who do you think would be most likely to fail? Hmm. Like either most likely to quit or like most likely to just just flop or like hit a plateau, like not uh, stuff like. That. I have no idea because like honestly, when people are like Trip Easy's community, I'm not even a hundred percent sure who that is. Because mm -hmm. like I'm I'm not. I know there's like Trip Easy and some of the people he's like friends with but i'm not sure who all exactly counts as being in the trip vz community you know i think it's just like all the artists in his server i guess yeah. oh see i'm i'm not in his server oh, so it's... uh yeah i i couldn't really answer that question sorry you, he, yeah i don't think you keep like very many tabs on his community like jay does for his yeah, no, I uh, I just kind of like chill on my own. So have you been? So speaking of Jay's community, um, Jay Legend and you know Baby Goat Music. I do. Um, have you have you interacted with his community at all besides Baby Goat himself? Uh, I have not. I don't even know if I've interacted with Baby Goat. Uh. Oh, I sent him, uh, originally he was going to be on the eviction cipher, so I talked to him about 
uh, custom beat, because I don't know if you know this, this is one of the other things that kind of like annoyed me about the Eviction Cypher. Originally, everyone had a different style of beat to complement their own styles. So like, uh, like Lynx had a very like trap uh, type beat. I had a very dubstep type thing and what ended up being the final beat was what i sent trip for his verse but like everybody else originally had a completely different beat so i had originally produced like uh i think i was up to nine different beats for that cypher and then uh trip vz just kind of like looped what i sent him and then was like okay this is the beat now so you got you you literally just completely lost eight beats Essentially, yeah. I mean, some of the people still got to use theirs. Like, I was like, here's just a longer version, go for it. But, yeah. Bruh. Yeah, I think you told me that. You two told me about that, which is a big oof. Big I, oof. As a producer myself, I can say, bruh, <laughs> losing eight beats? Damn. That is a bruh moment. Well, yeah, the... Although, I will say some of them actually went kind of hard, so I'm just going to uh, go back and use them myself. Yeah. <laughs> That's the benefit of being an artist and a producer, is that, oh, beat didn't get used? Well, use it yourself. Yeah, exactly. Um, on call. But, yeah, I, uh, I'd only interacted with Baby Goat, like for talking with him about the beat i don't even remember which one was his honestly and then uh after that he would send me uh like he would just send me a link to every new video that he put out and i didn't really watch them so he just stopped yeah. sending them to me yeah and yeah. that's all the that's all the interaction i've had with him so you really haven't like touched on goat's community at all not really. I've I've heard a little bit about it, like from Trip, but that's that's about it. All right. Um, and I know you have interacted with like this, uh, like the ETX kind of side of things. Uh, what's your opinion on that? Uh, I mean, so far the ETX community has been like super chill, like not not a lot of drama, not uh. It, it was worse from what I heard. Oh. It, it's yeah. been worse like past um before encore joined which was like july july yeah like early like 2020 was like awful pre-july it was yeah. just beef and now it's just chillness because no one likes <laughs> because beef is just no. irrelevant now apparently yeah yeah so, like i feel the, like i joined at the right time because it's just very chill and it's just a bunch of people like appreciating each other's music you know yeah that's yeah, if you would have earlier this year you would have been saying the opposite yeah you probably well, would have been talking about it like you would have been talking about trips yeah i mean i don't really have a problem with like trips community it's just that i didn't i don't know i guess it's like just i didn't vibe with it you know this is unwanted. Like, why would you want that? Yeah. 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 Um, let's see. Definitely unwanted. Would you, um, so you didn't interact with Baby Goat's community. Have you listened to any of Baby Goat's music? I have. Um, uh, what's your opinion on that? Uh,. Let me let me go to my YouTube and see what what of his exactly of because it's been a while. Uh, he only has a discography of about like four songs, I think. Maybe I five. mean, Okay, uh, I just looked up Baby Goat diss track, and I saw he tried to diss since July, which is definitely a mistake. Yeah, uh, yeah he, uh, he lost that. He lost that. Uh, I, I, find, I find it funny that, like, someone that people, like, even outside of um, the ETX community can tell just, like, 
Yeah, that was a mistake. Dissing since July. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've I've talked with since July a lot, and uh, dude's super nice. I'm still scared to like get on a track with him just because he's that nice with it. So, uh, yeah, but I think, uh, like, just the, uh, like, I think he, Baby Goat, has, like, good ideas. You know what I mean? I just think maybe, and I can say this about my own music, too, like, there are good ideas in there, but I think the execution and, like, the delivery of it could sometimes use work. Uh, and I definitely, this is just a personal thing, but, uh, like listening to that since July diss track for like 10 seconds, it, it was very clear to me. He was very young. You yeah, know what I mean? He's 12, 13, I believe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm older than him. Yeah, but yeah. this is older than him. Yeah. And like... Young artists sometimes like if you if you're good at delivery, the uh like, like being young doesn't real isn't really like a hindrance. Like if you guys heard like uh Land and Fire's song with Tech Nine. I think I heard about it. I didn't listen to it though. I've heard about yeah, it. Yeah, the Yeah, the dude is uh the kid on there is thirteen. And he absolutely murdered a song with Tech Nine, but and he uh, and like he's, I guess my best example of like a kid who's very very clearly a lot younger than most people rapping, but who can still like use their voice and their delivery to perform well, and I just don't think uh. Baby Goat has that down yet. If um if if that was all that Baby Goat's community was, just like people like him, maybe like a bit of differing ages, uh, how would you feel about interacting with the rest of them? Uh, I don't really know because I don't really know who all is even in Baby Goat's community. That's, that's I'm not, not the case. His, his community isn't bad, but if it was, how would you feel about it? Uh. I, I don't really know because I don't I'm not too like familiar with Baby Goat as like a person I understand him as like a musical artist but like personality wise I'm not I don't know enough to really talk about it I'm maybe not the best guest to have on a podcast yeah, okay no. yeah yeah <laughs> Let's, we need guests. This this podcast gets incredibly boring. It doesn't. We just get incredibly boring because we have less topics. So guests just make it easier for us to not talk. <laughs> <laughs> um, All right, cool. I can see that. Uh, let's see. Um, I'm I'm just thinking right now. <laughs> oh, what first got you into music? Uh, actually, when I was, like, uh, geez, I don't know how young I was. It was probably, like, uh, I'm trying to think, because, like, for basically my entire life, I've kind of been, like, into music. I want to say maybe, like, kindergarten or first grade, I wanted to do, like, heavy metal and, like, Play the electric guitar i never got around to doing that but uh then like second and third grade i got into rap like just listening to it and then uh like third fourth uh i started taking music classes at my school and trying to write rap and uh then I had a period where I wanted to do music, but I had, like, no microphone, no, like, no computer. Basically, I just had, like, a phone 
and I was like, I'm gonna do an album, and I'm gonna have, like, really big features on it, and I'm gonna be, like, the next big artist, and then just nothing ever came from any of the music that I tried to write, so I had a three-year gap where I did absolutely zero music, because I was like, everything I'm writing is trash, and then, uh, the earlier this year I just had a long period of time with nothing to do and I was like might as well write a rap and then uh yeah that's how I got back into the music that I'm doing now I had some other musical stuff that I did like I played violin piano and ukulele but when it comes to rap like really it was just because I was bored one day and I wanted to do a contest. Is that the story for King Cobra? Yes, that is, actually. Alright. I was like, okay, um, out, of every, out of everything you have out currently, what do you think is the best thing, like, what do you think is, like, the best thing you've made <laughs> out currently? Uh, I am, I'm torn between, uh, my verse on the eviction cipher, because I think that is my best, like, vocal delivery in a song so far, and, uh, um... The uh, Demogorgon, which was the original verse I did for Demo Killers, uh, not because I like delivered well vocally on that. I have actually had like multiple people uh, talk to me and be like, "Hey, do you wanna like? I almost really like this song, but can you just like re-record it so your vocals have more energy?" And I'm I'm so done like legitimately i'm just so done with that verse and having to like redo it because like i already had to rewrite it the first time when yeah. the song name got changed i'm just so done with it i don't even want to like revisit it i know the vocal performance isn't as good as it could be i just i'm done with it at this point but uh uh the demogorgon version i added my own uh kick snare and 808 too and i feel like the entire beat like that might be the best i've done with just production although i did also produce the eviction cipher and i feel like that turned out pretty well but i think the demogorgon verse was like Enough of it was already there that I could just make a few minor tweaks and make it, the beat at least, extremely fire. So, I'm torn between, yeah, Demogorgon and my Eviction Cypher verse. Alright, um, let's see. So you were on Chronic's song Slept On, and did you, you knew it was on his album, correct? Yeah, I did. Uh, yeah. How do you feel about that album getting cancelled? Uh, I don't know, because, like, I did want to see what else he had, because, uh, actually, there are some times when I've, like, done a feature for someone, and I'm like, their verse maybe isn't the, uh, the greatest verse ever, you know, like, I... Mm -hmm. But uh, with Chronix, I actually didn't even hear his verse before the song came out. So I was like, this is actually a pretty solid verse. Like, I'm I'm not sure what I was expecting from him, but he has blown my expectations out of the water. And uh, so I definitely wanted to see what else he had to bring. So I'm kind of kind of disappointed that got canceled. But at the same time, you know, my songs, my song with him is still out there, so. He's making an EP, I believe. Yeah. Okay. It's it's an EP where, since a lot of his music before was ignorant, he's, he's trying to, like, divert away from that. Okay. 
which uh, a lot of people are glad are happy about so we get to see other styles from him yeah his yeah. style's basically been ignorant for so long it's either an ignorant song or a diss track and like literally nothing else that's all he's done yep until now yeah okay well i am definitely i'm definitely looking forward to seeing more styles from him um so you've obviously you, you've most definitely seen all the tier list videos. That's that's no shocker. Yeah, no. Every single time I see a tier list, I don't even know who, uh, like made the tier list to begin with. I just know every single time I look at these tier lists, uh, I see my logo on there, and I'm like, okay, now I have to go check this out. I actually have a playlist of uh, videos on my channel that's just stuff that i'm mentioned in or like have helped with so it's like uh tier lists by chronic viz trip uh encore yeah uh the demo killers versus slept on is on there uh and then i also have uh the trailer for sylvic and bard song arsenal just because i added that one so, yeah, I just basically have a playlist of stuff I mentioned in. So with those tier lists, um, going in, where did you, where was, like, the whereabouts? Where did you expect to be? Uh, I would say, like, uh, B or C tier, because I remember the first tier list I ever got put on was uh, Trip VZ did a tier list and i'm pretty sure he put me and him in the same tier <laughs> yeah he did he did he put both of you in b i believe yeah so i was expecting to be around <laughs> b excuse me um obviously that didn't turn out i'm pretty sure you've been putting a in every single one besides trips yeah yeah uh that was that was a very pleasant surprise for me uh i definitely one thing that was really great about those tier lists is uh i got to see who people thought were better than me and go check those people out so did you agree uh, or disagree with most of those uh, I agreed with most of those just because, uh, personally, I don't, just looking at what I have out so far, I don't think I'm that great, so I definitely agreed with a majority. I don't think there was a person people said was better than me who I disagreed with. Um, yeah, those tier lists are, tier lists are yes. Um, he said, um, you clearly want to ask. Yeah, I, I was thinking about it, but then I really just thought about, like, then I remembered, eh, it's kind of egotistical of me, and then I just decided against it, so. Okay, okay, um. Let's see. If Equinox wants me to ask it, I will, but... Mm. Yeah, look, uh, yeah, just go ahead. I have no problem with being egotistical because, like, clearly a lot of this interview has just been me saying how not great at things I am, but when I actually start writing, I definitely get in my egotistical bag, so I think everyone else in here is definitely also allowed to be egotistical. All right, then fair enough. So, I don't know if you have, but if you have, wait, no, I screwed up the question already. Epic. Great. Um, nice one. Um, have you heard of me? Yes, I have. Have you heard of? Have you heard my music? I think I have. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> part where you ask his opinion of it. Yeah. I was about to ask the opinion, and then he just said think, and I'm like, ah, well, there goes that. 
Ouch. For me, because I know I am... I know I am... Wait, you're... What is your channel named? Um, ND Gaming. Okay, so yeah, I know I am subscribed to that already, mm. but... Uh, let me, let me look up the, uh, some of the most recent music. <laughs> the is, intensity this is this is less about like me just thinking about how intense like oh man he's gonna talk about my music and more about um god i really wish i shouldn't i didn't ask this because my brain says egotistical and my brain and i'm trying to go against that so the suspense i can definitely it's it's very vibey you know what i mean there's very much a yeah. good vibe to it. Yeah. I could vibe to this. Epic. Now I have the sound <laughs> for memes. I could vibe to <laughs> this. <laughs> He's going to be using that in all of his videos from now on. <laughs> yeah, every time he makes a beat, that's going to be the tag. Just Equinox saying, I could vibe to this. Yes. That is going to be beautiful. And what would make it even better is if I made a meme beat and it said... And it was the Equinox, uh, his tag is just Equinox saying what the tag. <laughs> just talking no, you gotta about get your the tag. N the Beats Brother tag in there too. Yeah, just Equinox talking about the tag and then ND Beats Brother. <laughs> that is the best tag I've ever heard, honestly. And then the Spongebob scene. No. Why not? No Spongebob. Yes, no. Anyways. No. Oh, you need to do like the... uh. Wait, what is that beat called? It's called like 316.mp3. Have you have you heard that one? Uh, I, I think that, I think I have. Oh no, it's 216.mp3. Here, let me just let me just yes, put it. Yeah, let me just let me just put it in chat. I want I want to know if you guys have heard of this. Maybe. Oh Can yeah, Louis. Louis a god at making beats. I need yes, to listen I have. to this. <laughs> Pretty good. Whole version worst beat ever made. Tried based. Uh, yeah, I've heard this. That's yeah. a great beat. It's a god that level I've, beat. I've very much considered multiple times actually writing something for the beat. Can you vibe <laughs> to it though? Uh, I wouldn't exactly say I vibe to it. <laughs> I would say that it's somehow. It's like, it's maybe the most disappointing beat I've heard because if you took away all of the instruments except for the drums, it would be a good beat, which Damn. is the most perplexing part of the beat. I like it. I think just like producers making purposefully bad beats, just like good producers making purposefully bad beats just is funny because, Internet. you know... I like it They're when you hear their tag, good. and it's like... But, no. Yeah. So, um... Besides a single tier. Um, so you've given your opinion on Endy. What's your opinion on uh, me and Viz? I'm asking for Viz, because Viz is not going to ask himself. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, you and Viz, I definitely think you're really good artists. Uh, I, Encore, I will say I've listened to you more. Uh, yeah. uh, which is absolutely no offense to Viz. It's just that me and Encore have just talked more in general, and he sent me stuff like, "Hey, what do you think of this?" I've, I've uh, sent everyone everything, basically. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, any general? Ah, uh, yeah. I should not be sending anyone general. So. <laughs> Why general is so godly? General is godly. I just don't want people to die when they hear. Like, yeah. they just die of how good it is. Yeah. Like, it's fair. too good for the human brain to process. Yeah. So yeah. It, just, it just dies. Anyways, Equinox, continue. Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, I was actually pretty, uh, I guess, excited when you guys both asked me to be on your songs. 
just because you both seem like good artists and the especially the beats you sent me were definitely like i can definitely see how these beats bring out the best in like encore and viz and also how i could go off on these in different ways as well especially encore because it's yeah. uh the song we have together Emo uh, he kind is... of he kind of destroyed it <laughs> not gonna lie it's well it's i wouldn't call it like it's not a beat you can destroy but like yeah it's like Like, yeah, like, it's P.S., like, you're most likely going to carry it. <laughs> look, if you want to go back and, like, change stuff for yours, just go ahead. Like, just, if you want to tweak yours until yours is better than mine, I do not care at all. Because it's, like, it's, I don't know how to describe the beat, but it's very, uh, I don't want to just call it, like, oh, it's sad. <laughs> you know, because that's, yeah, that's, that's very basic. Uh, but it's, you know, I'll just, I'll just call it sad and a lot different from anything that I've done before. So... Yeah, that was like the main thing that I was like concerned about. Like, why, why should I get fast rapper guy on a sad song? And then I, I figured why not? That's why Baby Go and Uncle will never collab. Yeah, we are, we are never going to because I don't think Baby Go can do that kind of sad style. Especially with this very high voice. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I I was very excited to get on that track because uh, that was actually like closer to what I originally envisioned all of my music to be like. And then I just started entering contests and it kind of went out the window. But when I put out like solo EPs and stuff... Or like even some of the stuff I'm doing with links, there's definitely going to be more of that on there. That's that's all I'm going to listen to. I'm not even going to listen to the others. I'm not going to. Um, <laughs> all right. All right. Encore's ego has been boosted now, and Viz Let's has go. been Viz has been Viz's has been destroyed. <laughs> yeah. No, Viz. I also I think you're a dope artist too. It's just that me and Encore have interacted more. But I, I am also incredibly excited for my song with you, especially because uh I have one of the like most intricate rhyme schemes I've ever done. Actually two of the most intricate rhyme schemes I've ever done. So yeah. We're you're I'm also great. You can ask both on uh, my Encore's album and my album, and he's both on the second, on the seventh song. Yeah, uh, that was completely unintentional. <laughs> yeah, but no, I, I... keep it that way. Yeah, I, I want to keep it that way. I like that. I'm gonna keep it that way. Same. Epic. Now you get to hear. Now when that song comes out, you get to hear those three on a song and me on a totally separate song and compare the two and realize that I'm garbage on that song. Woo! <laughs> Whoa. I'm pretty sure both albums have 13 songs as well. Um, Mine may or may not have 13 songs. It Like, it, it does right now, but I'm releasing an EP with the songs I don't like anymore. Mm. So I might have to shave a track off to make it 12. But I, I think I'll keep it as 13 just, just for the just, just cause. Just because of the memes. Yeah. Yeah, because that's like a good number to have on an album. Yeah. It I don't get why people put like anything under 10 tracks as an album. I don't know why. I see an EP as like 3 to 8, like 8. I, I, even though an album is technically considered as 8, I see an EP as like 3 to 8. And then an album is yeah, like... EP is like 3 to 6. Okay. I know, but... I, I, just don't I think 3 is too low. Yeah, like, three's too low. Yeah. Three's it's like four to, four to eight. Yeah. And then an the album for me is like a like 10 or 11 up to maybe like 17 or 18. I feel like anything more than that is a little bit stretchy unless you can do that well. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, sometimes uh, like some, I know like, are you guys familiar with like Chris Webby? At all. I am definitely familiar um, with Chris Webby. 
Viz, yeah. Uh, that's a no. All right, Viz continue. Is, Viz is dead. Yeah, that's a no. So, uh, <laughs> uh, Chris Webby, do you know him? No. no. Okay. Uh, I mean, sometimes you can have, like, a lot more than maybe, like, say, uh, 16 to 18 tracks if they're stuff people have already heard before plus, like, new stuff. So I feel like I know Chris Webby does that a lot. Maybe not mm-hmm. as many as I said, but, like, he, he really do... a lot of songs. Yeah, and then he just puts them all in one album. It's actually kind of what I just realized Gone does now. Like, he releases one song at a time and then just puts them all in an album at the end of the year. Luckily, I'm not doing that. I'm not releasing the entire album. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, yeah, I just bring that up because uh, I just remembered a thing when we were talking about how many songs should be on albums. And... uh. I think it's like what what exactly is the name of this podcast? Indies uh, Indies meme cast. It okay. has nothing to do with memes by the way. No, All right, cool. Uh Okay, well I just realized uh I technically could give you guys like an Indies meme cast exclusive. Ooh. Like a uh, yeah, Ooh. first time anyone's hearing this one. Uh Ooh. All the EPs uh me and Links are doing are going to be put together in an album and then we're going to be adding more songs to the album including a cypher so uh you're, yeah, you're doing too much coming... here no we're, we're really not we have it all spaced out we're actually uh we have all of this stuff planned to a t so like uh we're even gonna be because he's from California, and I'm from Washington. So we have a whole, like, over the summer, we're going on a road trip to just different shooting locations to shoot music videos. God. I wish I had the money to do that. <laughs> I, wish, I wish we all had the close proximity to do that. Yeah. We live at three completely different points of the U.S. Literally different time zones. Yeah, all three of us live in different time zones. I mean, oh yeah, I just put in chat the picture that everyone's gonna be seeing um throughout the podcast. Yeah. Oh nice. <laughs> it's very nice. We made the picture ironically and then the the podcast itself is non ironic. Somehow the two, <laughs> somehow the two contrast. Okay, uh give me just a second. Uh, Damn. Equinox is now dead. We've killed so, him on our own podcast. Damn. They should. We should all make a collaborative uh, album, and that should be the cover art. There's Envy's meme cast. XD, 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 A Lamau. Just, just the track list for a, like just for a complete. No, for the uh, for, for the come up. For the come if up. If anything, I think you guys mm-hmm. should do a collaborative album and have that be the cover. Yes. Like all three of us. Yeah. Maybe? All three yeah. of us. Maybe. I mean, all the regulars on the meme cast. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> and then the features that are on the meme, the people who feature on the meme cast are <laughs> also features on the po- on the album. Yeah. This Honestly, has never been done the before. Features. That has yes. never been done. That's actually. That's a good idea. It's a good idea. I'm glad it... Encore. But not Encore and Equinox came up with it. <laughs> But we're just we're just smart. I'm like going that. to smack you, Andy. Viz, it wasn't your idea. Be quiet. Nobody, Viz, nobody likes you, Viz. Viz, you're the most useless person ever. Yeah. By the way, we like to bully Viz, so just just mind. That. I I can t- I can tell. <laughs> Crying emoji. <laughs> Viz, I think you're cool. Don't worry. Cringe, cringe that you would say Viz is cool. <laughs> we just just let it happen. Yeah. Fuck you, Viz. <laughs> <laughs> this is totally ironic bit by the way we, yes. we don't yeah, so we don't things. we don't actually hate viz yeah i i know probably. i got that <laughs> probably speaking of collaborative totally off topic somehow yet still on topic speaking of collaborative i mean i can't spell heads shut up <laughs> shut up viz yeah fuck hey, you viz. no one likes you equinox would you like to be on 
a song with me sometime eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you so awkward about it? Because I am. I don't normally do this. It's just an equinox. It's just a yeah. random equinox in the wild. Equinox. Yeah, exactly. Song uh, with me. Yes or no? <laughs> Yes, just sometime in uh sometime in twenty twenty one because right now I have a uh, an EP coming out this month that I'm trying to get nailed down. So as soon as that is done, uh, I would be happy to hop on a song with you. All right, epic first twenty twenty one song. Just kidding, twenty twenty one song coming out. Uh, Equinox feature, epic. <gasps> yeah. That's another Andy's meme cast exclusive. You won't yes. hear that. Yeah, you're only else. you're only gonna hear it on the Andy's meme cast. Yeah, this is why. Yeah, probably come on to the meme. And cast. then, and then when the song comes out, you'll hear about it then too. Yeah. No, no, the song's never gonna come out. <laughs> it's, it's we're just gonna play it on a random episode of Andy's meme cast, and that's not give like anyone cool and not give anyone a timestamp, so they have to watch the whole podcast to hear it. No, in the middle of, like, the, like if we go more than one season, we should just go in, like, the middle of the second season. Just play it out of nowhere. Technically, <laughs> the first season is just this year, so every podcast that's going to be put out this year, which should be all of the four that... We, wait, is this the fourth one? This is the third one. No. Math. No, we made two. Didn't we make two before? Or... We, made we made one, one with one. just us three, and then one where we had Jay in the last, like, half hour. Yeah. And this one with Equinox. Okay, so these three, and then maybe another two uh, put out this year. Then we'll and call that'll it a be, day. And that'll be season one, and then season two will be just 2021. Just like 50 podcasts. <laughs> 50 podcasts. We should do a Christmas one, because why not? Yeah, that's yep. true. Actually, we may or may not have to have, like, family to spend time with. <laughs> oh, family? This family? Ew. <laughs> Ew. Anyways, Equinox, um, do you want to talk a little bit? We've been kind of excluding you. Oh, no, it's fine. I've just been sitting back and enjoying the conversation. <laughs> this is exactly what the podcast that Equinox had a TV for. channel. This is... Yeah, he does. Equinox this is, TV for memes. This is basically... All this podcast I have a, is. I have a channel called Equinox TV, and it's for uh, memes. Yeah. I'm not joking about this. I think I'm sub to it, which is. I, I just sub to it. Wow, you're fake sub. You're fake sub. Fake sub. I am though. sub to it. <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm actually probably going to be putting the uh, "How I Made the Beat for the Eviction" cipher video there. Mm. If that ever gets made. I've been trying to trying to make that forever and I just uh kind of unmotivated to do it. it the... Everything you've done has over a hundred views. That's... that's is that is that good or bad? I mean or is considering that just you have fact? thirty it's it's mostly just a fact that like maybe you can be proud of it, I don't know. Do, do what you want with that. Uh... Epic. Confused. Conviction <laughs> Cipher trailer and the trailer for Eternal that are almost at a hundred. Shut up! Yeah. Shut up, Viz. No one fucking likes you. I don't. I honestly don't know how the Eviction Cipher uh, instrumental got over two hundred um, views. Popular. It's because no. It's because it's the instrumental. The most popular video on there is Demo Killers with 500 views, dear god. That's 500 views? Yeah, that's 500. Demo it killers... had like 300. Why does Demo Killers, out of all things, have 500 views? That's a good question, and I have no idea. Not it's to probably in... just DZ's first song without all the static. Not to insult you, Equinox, because I like your part and everything else that isn't trip vz but like song oh, no you can bad. insult the song song's kind of bad yeah it, it's 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 mainly at, at the time dz's part like i don't know passable not even passable just <laughs> like during this was like at the beginning of the whole beef yeah whole, like, etx second war second oh yeah second. No. i thought it was brotherhood yeah, was brotherhood. first. No. 
right. unless there was like one unless there was a random one I, I forget about i was gonna say hip-hop boy beef but sure that's not that a was war. kind of a beef that was, that was not that really was, a war was, you can say the ray the whole ray thing was a war but i don't it know it was a war bro Literally, hip hop boy. Yeah. Um, let's see, hip hop boy, J Modus, J Modus, um, Trent Niblo. Well, yeah, tr those those were all people on one side for like majority of it. What well, didn't Trent switch sides at like towards the uh, end of it? No, Niblo. Niblo did okay. I'm pretty sure they both switched sides at the end of the hip hop boy yeah. beef. They both did. J Modus. Anyways, J Modus yeah. is very epic. J Modus. That's good. Yeah, it's just too bad that we have a feature on this podcast that we're totally ignoring. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm I'm just uh I'm checking just out it my. Yeah, I'm just letting it happen. I just I'm just going with the flow. Epic. Just vibing. I'm, we, yeah, yeah just he's... merely vibing. You're just vibing to the worst beat ever. <laughs> No, I was actually checking how many views the uh one of the memes that I put on yeah, dude, my one second of your videos channel got. Jesus, two four K. Yeah. Two yeah. yeah. what? Two thousand views on one of his um Equinox. TV one of my videos. memes, and the other ones haven't even crossed like thirty. Uh, yeah, thirty. Seven twenty five, and then two point four K. Something's wrong here. It's just how you count, you know? That's just how to count. Yeah. Kinda reminds you of Antarctic Beats, uh, where one- where the most popular has like 2.4 million, and, and the, the other one's one not like... even at 50,000. Not even at 50,000, so... Views. Yeah. Big oh my gosh, wait, I actually know. You're- you're- Yeah, I just looked up Antarctic Beats, and I know exactly what you're talking about. If you go to most popular... They have their one beat. track type beat, Rage. 2.6 yeah. million. Oh, I, I remember. I don't really get why people like it. I really don't like that beat. Oh, that beat. That one. Yeah. This yeah, that one. Oh. Most yeah. notably, Skull used it on Trent. You're so, you're so vague. Like, oh yeah, that one. By that Sorry. One. <laughs> Made for that track. And like the second most popular one, I think is way better than the most popular. Yeah, it's a fact. He's just underrated. It's just underrated. And yeah, it does. It know. has less than 15k. Well, that one has 2.6 million. And the rest. See, I only, I only follow sad beat producers. So I, I knew, I know Antarctic beats, but I don't follow like any beat producers besides Valley, and Nori. And the 2.6 million one is the only one that has all the subscribers watching it. Yeah. The one has 12k, Antarctic Beats has 14k. See what beat producers wow. I follow. I follow more than I thought, oh my gosh, wait a minute. I, I literally only uh, follow emo beat producers. I follow beat uh, producers, and I also, like, I follow beat producers, but yet somehow... 27 hearts. 27 hearts. Yeah, 27 hearts is... Did they barely... They barely use... Anabolic beats, which I don't. Oh, use. anabolic! I think I'm following them. I might be. Or Kiro, which I'm only starting to use. I like Soggy Mara a lot. Anabolic yeah. beats. Oh, that. Uh, he used to do. Uh, I don't know how to say that name. CXDY. I don't know what that means. I don't yeah. know how to say it. You mean Cody? I used to. Oh, okay. Cody. I'm not the big brain. No. Soggy Mara. And I'm not the big brain. Yes. Cody. Cody, Cody I, I used producer. to use. Um, I, yeah, same. Y'all ever heard of Lester? Lester, yes, I have. Lester, I love that yeah. dude. Yeah. Yeah, I actually have one of his drum kits. I used it for the uh, Eviction Cypher. He's, like, his drums go so hard, it's actually insane. That's, that's true. I wish I had that. I wish I had more drum kits from producers because drum kits hey, go uh, hard. Yeah, Lester has a free one. I can send you the link. Oh, epic! Please. Yeah. Can you guys imagine know, being a beat producer, uh, bro? Imagine no. not being a beat producer and having to pay to use beats exclusively. Cringe. 
Yeah, Fair shut enough. up. Can we bully Viz now? No. Damn it. Yes, let's bully Encore instead of me. <laughs> no, we're Damn. bullying none of you. Oh, Trent just DM'd me. He's about to use face cam on stream. Ooh, epic. <gasps> we're gonna get to see Trent. But he said he. But he told me um off stream that he's using a mask like Andy. So. Uh, oof. Uh -huh. Hey Andy, I just I just sent you the link to the drum kit. Epic. Thank you. Yeah. And the X Equinox will be yes. Shut up. I have. Damn. I'm looking through my tracks and I just start to realize how many I have just produced, which is like. Maybe a total of like six. That's a lot. Even though I've made a lot of beats, specifically like. 100. Still waiting on the collaborative beat with you and Exa Square. That was supposed to happen like months ago. That was supposed to happen yeah. in March. The Exa Square ND beat, where Exa Square made the beat and ND did nothing. <laughs> no, he, we didn't get any melodies. No. Neither of us sent melodies or anything. You and Vorbis made a beat before you before you and Esquire made a beat. That's true, but I don't see. How oh yeah, the yeah, SS7 beat, but then yeah, SS7 that you know we died. we you know that we have to make that we have to use, but has haven't used it yet. Yeah, it's seven minutes long. I'm sorry. So what? I got enthused so what? Vor within making Vorbis, it. Ass. Vorbis and Andy have made a seven minute song. I think the three of us could make one. Oh dang, Lester's doing a. Uh... Freestyle contest. I'm probably gonna have to. The deadline is this Saturday. I might. Honestly, it's Lester. I might have to go off on this. <laughs> I wish. I wish I could. But I suck yeah, at freestyling. You... I can't freestyle at all. I, I have. I have the godly skill of freestyling. Yeah. Uh. Is an email. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Andy be kind of be kind of became a meme. Yeah. Andy freestyling Cause... became a meme. Bro, yeah, be because fair, of one because, verse. Yeah, one freestyle verse out of <laughs> my, like, 900. That just turned out to be bad. Listen, and now you're the rest mean. of my diss tracks and freestyled stuff was good, but because of one Wait, freestyle, no, no, no. I'm bad. No, there was two. There was the one that Miles pointed out where you made it, like, seven minutes long and then, like, nothing. And, like, there's no shots or whatever. And then there was the Cotton the verse. I think your best freestyle was the end one. Mm. I'm just gonna go skip to. Oh, Trent DM'd me too. Trent doesn't even like. I don't even talk to Trent that much. We were supposed to do a track together, but he just completely ignored me. Me and Trent were supposed to do like a bunch of tracks together. Then he ended up releasing it without me. You should make a, a collab album with Trent. That would be beautiful. <laughs> yeah, and then who released the whole album without me? Who just released the album with Pol Pol without And, like, me. replace me with, like, fucking Mark. <laughs> Mark? <laughs> <laughs> like, you'll send him a verse, and then he'll just use the version with me on it. And Mark. Me and we'll, Mark on the same We all get this, but then Equinox Equinox doesn't get any of this. Yeah, I'm not Equinox social enough to understand. It's fine. Yeah. This community is very so, good. So, uh, do you know MTS Psycho? Probably not. I probably not. I actually I actually became aware of them when uh I think it was uh Viz thought I might have dissed them on the eviction cipher. I didn't by the way, but still. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, I know who this is cuz they did the uh diss track tournament. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, I forgot. Like yeah, I forgot that I have to respond now, and I and I'm I have like, to judge. I'm like three weeks late on the, not three weeks, like like a week and a half late on that. I should probably yeah, do like that. yeah, like the eight day thing just doesn't matter anymore. It's it's because the battle's more important, and like people would know that I'm actually gonna respond, unlike Jade. Yeah, Jade had like three, like had two weeks and didn't do anything. Yeah, and I'm I'm in two weeks, and I can record it right now if I wanted to. Yeah, I have. But I don't want no, to. No, you record this instead. Yeah. yeah I, I don't want to record it right now. I could, but I just don't want to. I have. I just counted uh, how many tracks of mine that I've produced by myself. And A billion. It's, it's produced 
that tracks that I produced and also made, you know, wrapped yeah, the, the, the yeah. whole shtick. Um, it's, 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 it's chill out. Like, it's like eight. eight cents wait Did you produce some of the uh, 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 what's it called? The isolation EP? Um, no. I produced no, like one track, and that was stuck. But that gives him I've lost That's track. That's why I got major chill up vibes. No, you said I've lost track I've vibes. lost track vibes. So I don't know. I don't remember. How dare you? You're a fake ND fan. Yeah, fake ND You think ND's fan. bad, probably. Are you? You don't even remember the vibe that ND told you to shut up over. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, we have many ins. We have many memes. One of them is Andy bad because trash people call Andy bad. Yeah. Oh. So, okay. Obviously, Equinox is chronic, right? Of course, you do know. Yeah. He doesn't like Andy very much. Mm. Oh. He okay. left a whole ass rap group because Andy because he didn't want to um do tracks with Andy. They like, both. I, I don't. I don't specifically, think okay, let's be more specific tracks. here. Hold on, wait, let's be more specific here. It's not just a whole ass rap group, it's the rap group that was that the entire community of ours is based off of. Yeah, he left it. He left after being. Hey, you guys want to know something funny this. about this? What? Something funny about this? What? I'm watching Andy stream, and literally the first um, comment in chat is not Andy, trend stream. The first comment is Andy Bad. By who? Bad. Low King Myers, so don't take it uh, seriously. But, um, <laughs> yeah, Chronic doesn't like Andy very much. And For some reason. Left, left ba one of the most important groups in this community just because Andy was in it. And then, and then when Miles pointed it out, Chronic said it was a misunderstanding. Even though when I brought it up to Chronic that, hey, Andy's in this group, you hate Andy and vowed not to work with him, he said, yeah, I'm going to leave ETX now. <laughs> oh yeah, it's not. It can't really be a misunderstanding. It can't be a misunderstanding if you left because of it. It can't be a misunderstanding between anybody in the group because ETX chat, ETX group chat is fucking dead. It it, it died like it's been dead. Four pounds it, back came in a thing. Yeah, but then this this group chat's already dead. We this group chat died in like five seconds. <laughs> No, it didn't. Okay, like, in, like, four days. We, we planned out a track, and then I took forever to do a verse, which I did do the verse, finally. But I it, it, I took forever to do a verse, and, and then I did it, and the, the chat's been dead. Mm. I should probably send that verse in the chat, but, like, it's really quiet, and I need this wired up the volume of it. Because it's, like, hella quiet. Quietness. It's, it's like hearing, um... I'm trying to like I'm trying to get like a comparison here. It's like hearing Chronic on like any song, with like on microphone. Like you got you. I don't think Equinox listen to microphone, but microphone by Chronic. It's basically that. It's basically that, but like even quieter probably. Mm. Hey, bud. Hey, Equinox. What's up? <laughs> I just wanted to say hey because I totally forgot what I was gonna ask. <laughs> oh cool. Okay. Let's see. Um Amazing when things like that happen. Because you're fucking stupid. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Didn't have to go in on um, him like that. I get very bullied. <laughs> yes, that's the entire point of this podcast, honestly. Bully visit and talk to random people. <laughs> yeah, and and other people watch us. Other random people watch us bully this. That's Real. that's the entire point of this podcast. Honestly, at this point, you should just change the podcast name to Bullying Viz. <laughs> that's that's what we should do. And these bullying Viz cast, boom, perfect. And these meme cast, but Viz is bullied. Yep, on every episode. <laughs> I'm looking on Trent's screen. He, he doesn't have he doesn't have it. He, has it, he had it on. It. He had it on. I took a screenshot. Oh. Uh. So now I'm just gonna go send it to him real quick. So now, cause he said he was gonna delete it. So uh. Wait, send it to me. I wanna see this. He said he's gonna delete the uh stream after he makes uh. it. So. Yeah. I got a fucking trash pick though. 
Wait, let me see if I can go back in the stream and find it. Okay. Holy crap, who's messaging me on PlayStation? <laughs> you. PlayStation. This is the whole bunch of those, uh, group chats that you just automatically get, uh, into. Where in the stream did he have his cam on? DX is dead. It bounced back and then died. Hey, no, no. So it, it, it was alive, then it died, then it bounced back, died again, was gonna come back, and then died again. <laughs> It's it's literally it's, it's it's just a roller coaster. Viz was right. It's death. What? Viz was right. ETX bounced back just to die again. Yeah. Viz predicted the future. We're still gonna bully him though, but he predicted the future. I like how everyone on the <laughs> ETX bounce back song was literally like, ETX posting again? <laughs> I must be blind. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, at that point, you guys haven't posted in like six months. No, a year. no, a year. Because the last thing they posted was oh. what liar. The last. Oh, that was uh. It's been too long. It's been too long and came before liar. Well, uh, no, actually, it's been too long. No, a year. Extreme it's been a year, is... but it's been too long. Was the last song before bounce back? Yeah. No, it was like a year. It, no, it's like yeah, literally, literally a year. year and five days. But basically a year. So it was literally like a year. Yeah, August 25th, 2019 was the last post. Before Bounce Back. And then Bounce Back was in what? Like September or August 30th. So their year everyone, anniversary of leaving. I like how everyone. Uh, I just found the ETX like, channel. And uh, I'm subscribed to it now, so yeah. Like how so everyone uh, said, Andy had the worst verse. You know, Andy. On what? A whole bunch I of mean... people said you had the worst verse in on Discord. And it was a mixture between me and Miles. I say Miles had the best verse though. Miles didn't he have a joke verse? Yeah, and he so and he verse? had the best hold verse. On, wait, hold on. Uh, my verse is just a bunch of filler. And then everyone yeah. thinks I dissed, but I didn't. <laughs> that sounds like, like every one of my verses. Mm -hmm. My turn. Oh, listen to this. Uh, I, oh, I was just I too used this. to dissing, so I just said stuff, and I guess it just made diss. Dude, for any current song, I basically just did all the way over and over. Yeah, that's kind of what we did. That's kind of what I did. I'm sense and offense and I'm leaving the suspense. I just can't do it. And I just say you instead of everyone because you is one syllable, everyone is four. Three. Yeah. But then it seems like you're referring to someone. People. Yeah. So I just lose. What if you're dissing me? I bet you're dissing me on it. Damn. Even though like I don't it. even think I knew you then. Well, it was in August, so I would have been oh, in the Then game. yeah, I knew you, but. I was and the we, person that didn't we have beef, most. Eve, too. Yeah, but I don't think I, I would diss you on um, an ETX song. Yeah, that, w that wouldn't make sense. Especially since at that time, no, I w was I being considered for ETX in August? I don't think so. Oh yeah, you were. You asked to be. You asked to be on it, and we said we'd um, see how your EP goes first. And then I did. And now you're. And now you're in it. And I'm not. <laughs> and I'm not on it. <laughs> yep. L. And let me see when I post mm -hmm. it. Because like, like no one talked in the ETX chat, so I can literally just scroll up and find it. Because ETX mm -hmm. has the dead thing. And has the death. It's a very chronic illness. Let's see. Um. Hold on. When did I speak? I don't. I don't speak very much in the ETX server. In the ETX community server. Um. Hold up. I'm gonna do a funny. Okay. Where in the ETX, am in the ETX groups, so no one is even gonna know. Oh, so the ETX group except for Encore. Yep, and I'm gonna keep it yeah, very Encore. not secret. Yeah. I used to be in it, and then 
I just got kicked out because rebrand. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. So, I was talking about how how am I being considered when I'm worse than Viz and Viz got kicked out, blah blah blah. Um, where the fuck is it? Uh, me talking about DH. Blah blah blah, what the fuck, where is it? Where the fuck is it? Well, why? I thought this. I thought the server was dead. Why is there so much going on? Petition to get Chronic into ETX, and that then that worked, and then he left. There we go. There's the fun. Kind of like a waste. <laughs> Lol. Yeah, actually, like he. <laughs> yeah, no, Esquire is here. Esquire appears offline. Esquire is, is just dead. Offline. Esquire is always offline for everybody. No, he appears offline. Yeah, even when he's online, he appears offline because fuck you. There we go. And yet, <laughs> Encore didn't say a thing about the funny message. I like it was how he. Funny. Like how you say, uh, you, here we go, and then, uh, what's it called? It's called, uh, I don't know. What was I gonna say? <laughs> oh yeah, then I get two, then I get two pings as soon as you say, here we go. It's epic. I think it, I'm pings. just gonna look at my messages, because I, I clearly said less than everyone else, so. Scroll, scroll, scroll. I said a lot of things. Sad um, trash emoji, damn. That's deep. Yeah, sad trash emoji is fire. So, Where the Equinox. Is it? Is Equinox even here anymore? Yes. Yeah, he yeah, is. yeah, I am. I'm gonna have to so, go pretty soon. But, uh, uh yeah. Let's, let's I, still, and... I still have time for some more questions. Yeah, let's try and ask him more questions and then we can just ignore him. Yeah, yeah we're okay. gonna keep ignoring him. No. Okay, I'm cool with that. Let's not ignore him. We got him on here for like a total of what's basically five seconds in terms of this podcast. Yeah. And now we're just ignoring him. Man. Yeah. Damn. Uh, who would you want to collaborate with the most? Uh, in, again, like, are we talking realistically or unrealistically? Like, realistically. Can just give it give us questions give us answers for okay. both uh well you need the content so i will do both uh yes uh i think realistically probably uh neb and tommy guns i know i'm gonna have a song coming with them uh but it's not it's not my song is the thing so like realistically like a goal of mine would to be to get both of them on one of my own songs because that'd be cool uh i less realistically would probably be people like gone vinjay or samad savage i say less realistically because like i'm i i i'm getting a job so in like a few months i will probably be able to just like afford a feature just off in indie amplify or something so yeah. and then uh like if we're talking totally unrealistically i'd probably say like uh, uh tech nine or uh chris calico or like king crooked or Buster Rhymes. Buster Rhymes is cool. I forgot Buster Rhymes exists. Yeah, I just had a new album drop recently. Um, so, who um who would you want to feature with most across all the like besides NEB and Tommy? Across all these communities, who who would you want to feature with the most? Uh, I mean, there is one person who I'm going to be doing a song with in 2021 who uh, 
actually, I don't know how long ago it was. Let me, let me look it up. Yeah, uh, yeah, like seven months ago, uh, this producer named Trunks had That's interesting. a contest that I almost did. And then I didn't do because this other uh, person named TZ, not not DZ, TZ, uh, did an entry. Easy. No. <laughs> and I was like, I was like, dang, this, like, I don't care what I write to this. TZ's is going to be better. So, uh, so I... you know how the producer's named Trunks, right? Yeah. So you've definitely heard of King Law. Yeah. His King name Law's used to be name. Trunks. Yeah. Which is kind of the funny. I heard Trunks yeah. and well, I just the... started sweating. I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the producer's name is spelled. I'm just going to put it in the. It's spelled like that. Pretty sure I sh I'm pretty sure someone showed him that and said, like, you should, you should collab with him. Why not? Yeah, so, uh, yeah, Drunk so TZ, uh, TZ is definitely someone I would like to be featured with, but that's, uh, already in the works. So I'm, I guess, I'm just mostly excited for that. And then, uh, same thing with Sins July, actually. Uh, we've talked about getting on a track together at some point so that mm. yeah that, i don't know if that is. ever is gonna happen but it's gonna it's gonna happen probably eventually and that'll be fun yeah since july is a very good person to collab with as i've literally collabed with him a lot you've made i think well, at least three songs with him not I've counting made, caught in the web i've made yeah, three. Because waiting alone, broken, and and five. Which is I hate five. Like. Five <laughs> is bad. Unironically, five is bad. Terrible. I hate it. Yeah, yeah, five bad. But, but um, it's fine. uh, I've made songs with him. He's very nice to work with, and honestly, you sh you, sh I'd like to see you work with him, because he honestly, can match your bad. vibe pretty well. No yeah. matter what, he can match any vibe pretty well. Yeah, he's yeah, and he's uh. We there was a day we were just talking with each other on Instagram. We were going back and forth, like basically arguing but not arguing over which of us is better. Uh, and he kept saying I was better than him, which I still do not believe at all. And uh, I kept saying he was better than me, which is you know, I stand by that. Uh, but the the best compliment he gave me was that when he comes down to like just writing, I have him beat. So I'll take that compliment. But yeah, I'm gonna work with him I'm at cold. some point, so I'm excited for that. I'm cold. Good for you on it's the The hoodie. It's like 22 degrees outside in our. Hi, cold. I'm Viz. Yeah, shut the fuck up, Viz. Hi, cold. I'm Andy. Okay, well, after that joke, I can see why all of you believe his. <laughs> he sees now. He sees the light. Uh, but yeah, my, my furnace is broken and it's this big cold. I don't know how to feel. I should just stop being cold. Get a hoodie or get like a blanket or something. I, my blanket is really far away and my really far away is like four feet away. But I don't want to reach over and get it. Get it, idiot. <laughs> no, it's too far. <laughs> Cold, but somehow still too lazy. Lazy. <laughs> I feel like, if like, I leave like Encore just freezing to death. death. Encore just freezing to death, but he doesn't want to get his blanket. Too far. Go get my... Shut the fuck up, You made me get my blanket. Haha, <laughs> ha, L. Hey. I hate you. Made me get my blanket. Well, hey, now you're not cold. No, I'm still, I'm still cold. 
You're, you're well, tough shit. You made me stop being lazy, and yet I'm still cold. <laughs> tough shit. Damn, Equinox is muted. Equinox say... is scared of this podcast. Okay, well, I have to go because food. You. Are you, you eat food? serious, Viz? Why at 8.34 p.m.? Yes. Oh, hey, don't Big bully Viz because he has to go because of oh, food. Because no. I have to go in like five minutes also because of food. Oh, yeah, Fuck. well, you can, you can go. <laughs> right now you're just, fine you're fine you're fine you're a guest has like to viz viz i can probably put it off but i'm just hungry then get the food and bring it here yeah. oh I've been, i'm not allowed to eat down here anymore well that's not my problem no, get the food okay and, and that's here. the end of the podcast oh, thanks for listening no, it's not yeah sure <laughs> no <But laughs> yeah, i'm you, sure i'll just put it hey, off so we can record equinox. podcasts yes. um that was well since equinox is basically gonna leave and we're basically ignoring him. That was the <laughs> time with Equinox. I hope you yep. enjoyed it. That was totally. Now we're gonna talk for another three hours. All right, cool. Uh, now we can just yeah, sit around I... for the rest of the have, have a good day. Thanks for have being on. Yeah, you too. Uh, I would glad. Uh, wow, I totally messed up that sentence. Why am I a rapper? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I would be glad to be on this podcast again uh, after I have something more interesting to talk about. Like, uh, yeah. maybe after one or two of the EPs that I'm doing drops, we could talk about that. Or after any of my songs with you guys drop. Yeah. All right. Well, anyways, peace out. Uh, All right. Peace. Nice talking to you. Nice talking to you. Yes, you too. All right. So, now, Viz. Fuck you, Viz. Viz, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Guys. And second of all, I'm gonna say this anyways, even though Equinox, it was me- kind of meant for Equinox, but like now that Equinox yeah, isn't I... here, I'm just kind of just gonna just gonna put it out here. Um, remember when that was supposed to be an interview? What? Yeah. <laughs> Listen, we did the interview part, and he didn't. Damn leave. headphones. Huh. Huh. I'm very hungry, but I am po- I am postponing food time. Yeah, just don't eat food. My, own, like, my kinda headphones weird. are pulling is stupid. Well, don't. Uh, don't. Okay, epic. Tell, Tell them, them not to pull guys. stupid. Now I can hear you guys. Yeah, shut up. Um, yeah. What did you say? Did you guys say anything we of importance? Was... Uh, uh, we, we said, said you're stupid a lot. Said that. Uh, yeah, we said you're stupid a lot. I said I was oh, hungry, but I'm postponing food time. Um, you can yep. go. This is me and Encore no. can carry this. No, we cannot go. No. We can, we can no. Encore. Oh, we've, we've got it. In... Yeah, but then, but then who do you have to bully, huh? Well, you we can bully, bully you. We can bully you for not being here while you're not here. Yeah. Yeah, we can just bully you for not being here. Yeah. It, then I refuse to leave. No. Fuck. Leave, fatty. Oh. Yeah, leave, bitch. Fuck you. <laughs> No, he's, no, he's muted. <laughs> he actually left. Damn. No, he's, yeah, I can't believe he left. Yeah. Oh, I actually didn't leave, but I do have to leave now. Okay. Well, oh, bye, bye. This is Fuck Boy Two. This is fu- This is Fuck Boy Two. Uh, on the podcast. Now you gotta listen to Fuck Boy One and Endy. Shut up. Yeah, I'm a fuck boy. Yes. Well, All right. So now that Viz is gone, fuck that dude. Viz has actually left. By the way. Like Viz Wait, is no so longer. The entire no, time. no, I don't know. But I was, I'm just clearing this to the viewers who are definitely staring not seeing what we're. Screen. Yeah, who are staring at funny Endy's meme cast picture, and I'm Viz here has to say, left. Like Viz is no longer in call. He's not even muted. He's not even in call anymore. He's gone. And that goes for Equinox as well. Just in case you couldn't yeah, tell he, already. He... Both yeah, Equinox. Is... Seems cool. Yeah, that's true. Anyways, He's um, very epic. I was gonna say. Now I'm just gonna say it without Viz here, but um, I mean, I guess it still kind of works. But um, what do you think about like since July, like helping, like really, like helping you out and helping you turn your what was basically what you basically the black hole EP, what you said was gonna be an EP for a long time. For quite a while. And it wasn't. And then... From August then, to, like, late October. And then, um... Uh... Um... Then... Frick. I need to stop stuttering. Uh, then, since July, said, Hey, 
you and then it became not an ep no it was it was an ep even when he was helping out but with the... um what do you think of since july and have him well if this out. what the fuck and him you. helping out um, I have a spoon for my fries and burger. Viz isn't in. Viz isn't in the podcast. He's definitely not here. He's muted. But um, so I mean, it's 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 good to know he thinks I have potential, especially like with such a short amount of time to yeah. be. Yeah, it's that's it's, something. It's 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 good to know because I've I've heard a lot of people's like early music and I. Yeah. Viz, stop pinging. Yeah, Viz. Cringe. Ping? Cringe. Um. I don't know. Like, because of Ben DMing with, um, Sin July, you know, Sin. Yeah, you, you can just call him Sin, right? Yeah, but I. Because podcast, I call him since July like an idiot. Anyways, because I've been DMing Sin for such a long time, I forget what it's. I I forget when my first collab with him was because, um, duh. It's been a while. Yeah, it's been a while. However, we started talking on October thirteenth, twenty nineteen at 9 18 p.m and he was the first one and he dm'd me so i dm'd him and it was and it was the and it was about the five feature so this is gone again that's cool did he actually leave the vc yes okay epic i don't think he was happy yeah what what the fuck is a little eggplant doing here I don't care. Hey, yo, little eggplant. I'm now up? unmuted. Haha, <laughs> I win. Oh, yeah? Well, I'll show you something even better. Bam, I win, bitch. <laughs> now he's he muted the little eggplant, too. Oh, my God. I win, bitch. Oh, God. Bisk just DM'd me a bunch of random lyrics that I don't care about. Um, uh, the majority of our early DMs were about um, Ray. Five. Oh, oh, Ray. Ray, yeah. Because of yeah, right. Ray um, gay. the Ray, specifically um, uh, his Ray's diss, um, the longer one that has, you know, Sin featured on it, so. Yeah, uh, Andy Man. Yeah, Andy Man. It's more about that. And then, um, uh, there's, like, a lot of, there's a lot of, um, stuff about, um, there's a lot of stuff about basically just there. There's just a lot of stuff, you know. And honestly, there's a lot of stuff in my DMs with him, but since he, you know, kind of left my um, like, and I I started talking to him in like I think very very late July, so July twenty eighth or something twenty ninth. It was just about like him giving feedback on. I think it was general because I had nothing out at the time, and I'm, he he told me later that. He thought he was ass, but he just wasn't... He, he thought it was ass, but he just wasn't in the mood to be mean. Mm. Um, it's very... Me and him have been DMing for um, a very seven, long... Uh, July 26th, very long, 2020. A very long time. Um, let's see. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, fun fact about... Um, uh, the, uh, the, the fun fact about, um, uh, waiting alone, um, it was totally, like, the fact that it became a song was actually totally unintentional, because I originally planned on posting it as a oh, beat. Oh, yeah. As a you were beat. gonna make a beat with a hook, but he really yeah, liked Yeah, like, it, so a beat, a beat with a hook, and so, um, it was March 2nd, specifically, that I said, okay, can you so can you mix and master the vocals that go with this beat so they sound decent please thank you and then i sent him the beat and the vocals and then he asked uh then he asked question and i answered it 
I'm not revealing the question because fuck you. Um, uh, so, um, we, he introduced me to, um, he introduced me to, um, spare music, and so, then he said, tomorrow for sure, then, on March 3rd, he said, tomorrow, bro, for sure, a lot of stuff went down today, and then, later, he said, yo, Andy, so, like, when do you start rapping and shit, I'm not mixing, yet i'm still at school i'm just preparing all this so i don't need to ask later if you put I think the beat... Viz wants to talk well too bad bitch if you put the beat and the vocals together unedited it should line up where the vocals start so i basically told him it's just put put together and work wow and so um told me there's then he told me about you know mixing told him about how things that annoy him with mixing and i said that sucks because it does because <laughs> this is biz ping you exactly <laughs> ping ping he's pinged me 23 times and he's dm'd me 18 times but i'm completely Jeez. ignoring him <laughs> yo you should stop I'm ignoring on, viz not gonna lie i'm i'm kind of telling the story right now anyways i know, I know. so yeah, yeah. we started um we started um just, um, <clears throat> so then, um, he, we can, we can, um, then later when he got home from school, I'm most likely guessing, he said, please let me be on this song. I like the beat. Please, I'm begging. And then uh, actually here, now here's the, here's the part that may surprise most people. So, after he asked, I said, you can be on it. I said, you can be on it. You can take both verses if you really want to. So, waiting alone, I wasn't even the one that suggested I should be on the song. Since July, just said, just said, are you sure? I feel like you should do a verse. And that's how my verse came to fruition, but... Viz, but um, since July, um, he, uh, basically original plans were, at least in my eyes, were eh. He can take both verses. I don't really care. I don't really care to like. I would want. I want like. I kind of. I remember wanting to be on it, but like then again, but the, I really thought about it and just said, well, since it did ask, and I don't really have anything prepared. So he can just do both verses, and he said, well, actually, and I said, damn, really just outplayed me like this. <laughs> and so that's how that happened. That just, that's really just how that happened, and honestly, I'm, <laughs> I'm glad that uh, he influenced me to get on it, because um, without him... Uh, without him just saying, like, because he didn't say, okay, I'll do two verses, basically, he said, because he didn't just say, okay, I'll do two verses, and uh, wait, and I actually did my verse for Waiting Alone, people actually respected my music now. They respect it yeah. now, so that's pretty epic. Anyways, now that I'm done with my story, uh, y'all ever heard of Viz? <laughs> No, I really yeah. haven't. Who's Viz? Yeah, me neither. Uh, me neither. <laughs> I just spam it. You No, I kicked him. <laughs> oh. Yo, I play. <laughs> Damn. I'll reinvite him. I'll just re-invite him real quick. Damn. He's back. <laughs> Lug plant. Yo, Lug plant. No! <laughs> Try coming this back now, bitch. Damn. This is mean. <laughs> it was this supposed to like be a bit. Next level bullying. It was, it was supposed to be a bit, and we'd laugh <laughs> at it, and then we, we'd just have him join back, but, like, now he's... 
Like, for some reason, not joining back on his main. Well, I don't think, he, I don't think he's no, on his I main kicked, right now. No, I kicked him on his main, so he should be able to join back. <laughs> just gonna tell him, just join back on your main, idiot. It's, this is kind of stupid, not gonna lie. Yeah. Um, is this going to return? He DM'd me. <laughs> he <laughs> oh, said I think he, he banned him. No, I didn't ban his main. No, it, it, this, this DM'd me saying, tell Andy unban. So, unban. I didn't, I'm looking at the bans right now. Literally, I'm looking at the bans, and it only says... You might have kicked them too much. No, I only kicked him once. I'm looking at the bands, oh. and the only thing that's banned is a little eggplant. <laughs> well, that's probably what that's probably what he's referring to. Just I'm just gonna start rapping to him. Join on main or feel pain. Join on main or feel pain. Hey, join on no, main. No, my name. Pain. Hey. You're gay. I'm eating lays. Damn. Well, fucking. This the user is banned from this guild. <laughs> well, fucking Trey. <laughs> It says he's banned, yeah. It says he's banned. So, join on main or feel pain. No, my, mm. my name, Ray. Okay, so, um, let's see. Try mm. restarting Discord, idiot. If I know how to spell. You don't. You're kind of dumb, not in the cap. Ah, <laughs> oh, my fucking dumb. My mom says if I have any missing assignments at the end of the week, my phone's gonna take it for the weekend. Damn. This is the exact reason why I don't do my work. Damn. I'm demotivated as is, because I'm at home. And home is not a school environment. Yeah. And then they ask for improvement, and then when I do improve, since it's not perfect, they get mad at me. Bruh. So... Kind of dumb, not gonna lie. Um, <clears throat> I can't believe that Viz isn't like back yet. Cause he's dead. Bro, Red Star kind of the best rapper in this community, not gonna lie. Red Star is kind of super fire. Okay, now I know you're being ironic. <laughs> When was I? When have I not been ironic? Almost everything I do is ironic. Damn, fair. Think? Nah, Rhett, Rhett. For, for real though, for real though. King Law, kind of the best rapper in this community. Ayo, epic. What I find he's, funny, he's like the... What I find funny is the fact that now the call is slightly more laggy now that Viz isn't here. <laughs> we need we need Viz here just to balance out lag and nothing else. We need him as a co-host. We can just use him to balance out lag. I did. He's telling me just check bands, and I did, bitch. Literally, I will send him a screenshot of the fucking ban list. Literally. Not even banned. Send him a different invite. Send him a different invite. Okay. Because, like, if you're banned and then you get unbanned, for whatever the reason, um, a different invite will get you in. Even if you resend the same invite, it works, I believe. But yeah, I would make another one. Okay. <laughs> Generate a new link. Copy. Viz needs to be here. This is very cool. Control V. 
Wait, well, who's unknown Trenton, and why is he basically DH? I, I don't know. He's he's DH in every single aspect. Try unbanning little eggplant. Is, uh, yeah, unban little eggplant, you dummy. I'll try unbanning his second. The dick. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna send him the invite again. Still says I'm banned. Sends the invite again. <laughs> Yo, Vins. Yo, you're mean. Okay. We're not gonna vote. Okay, We're not gonna so, bully no, so the main reason why I said it, just go on to browser and use VPN is because sometimes bans on secondary accounts, on like account, on other accounts, because you have the same IP address mm. without VPN, you have the same IP address and all that complex Wi-Fi stuff, you're still I'm next banned. I'm my Wi-Fi box now, so I sound you're a bit still, better. You're still banned? So, um, basically, you sometimes with Discord, even if you're banned on a totally separate account, you sometimes have to use browser and VPN just to get, um, you know, just to actually be able to get into it with second account because Discord is stupid like that. Yeah. So that's why I, I wasn't working. Pizza. What? Wow. That's the welcome thing was welcome Viz. We hope you bought pizza, so I just put a pizza emoji. No, you just bought the pizza. No one even. You're not it's funny, by the way. You're just, stupid. It's kind of cringe. Viz. It's kind of cringe. Not gonna lie. I, ju I joined back just to get bullied. Yeah, we we like bullying you, bitch. This is the right pizza. Wow. Damn, I He's wish mad. it wasn't. I wish it wasn't a fucking custom emoji. Nah, bro, this a this a nitro emoji. It's a fucking custom emoji, bitch. Well, it's from a different server. Yeah. And I wish I itself. could be able to use fucking different server emojis mm -hmm. because, you know, there are some <laughs> different server emojis that are actually good, but, like, I can't use them because well, fuck you. Yo, Viz, so I left no. so I can get ice cream real quick. Damn. Oh, hey, jeez, bro, you keep even leaving. I don't even... Fatty. You're kind of weird. Fatty to be weird. honest, I'm not, I'm not even capping right now, Viz, it's kind of weird. I'm sorry, you guys have free time. Okay, I don't. I should be doing my work right now. Because if I don't, I'm going to get my phone taken away. Look <laughs> so what I'm doing. Don't <laughs> so I don't you want to. Even be here. <laughs> what I do is I, I just wing it. Like, literally, literally, when we're going over answers, I just turn in my math homework. Yeah, that doesn't apply for me. It they shouldn't apply like for me, but somehow it, they just don't look. Damn. I can't do that. It, like, my teacher knows that, like, that's something I would do. Uh, yeah, I don't know how he dumb. knows. But my teachers are pretty dumb, but like... I was talking I, to I mean, Viz. Yeah, shut up. Viz is stupid. Okay, fat ass. This is ice cream is more important than a podcast. Apparently. What? Like, what if we all died? Would you be happy about your ice cream? Yes. Wow. See, that's... The Asshole. <laughs> I mean, ice cream doesn't bully you under ice cream. Okay, and... Okay, but we're your friends. We have more value than that fucking ice cream. To be fair, he has a point with the bullying thing. But we're still his friends. No, we aren't. But you guys don't taste as good as ice cream. How do you know that? It's fucking cringe, bro. Yeah, I regret saying that as soon as I said it. <laughs> Not yeah, even being homophobic. Cringe. That was just like cringe. <laughs> yeah, that was cringe. You guys don't taste this? as good as ice cream. <laughs> the worst sentence said on a podcast. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, you guys don't, don't taste as good as ice cream. Yeah, fuck off, Liz. You probably don't even taste good. 
I don't imagine flesh tastes <laughs> good in the first place, especially human okay, flesh. Okay, but this in particular, this in particular. Yeah, I bet his hasn't good. showered in three years. I don't even think he has a shower. He just has like he just has like a like a cardboard box <laughs> that just says shower. Yeah, like it's just a cardboard box full of water you got from the lake, and and the box just, and marker just says shower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and you spelled it wrong. You're stupid. You spelled it. And every every year you just sit in the he box for like. He spelled an it. Hour. He spelled it like. He spelled it like that. Yeah. Sure. Sure. No, it's like. No, you guys are stupid as shoals. Brain dead as shoals. Spelled it like that. No, Shwari. Shwari. I, mean, I don't know why, like but I'm trying game. to drink ice cream. Why are you drinking ice cream? You. You. Nah, Ugh. actually. Ugh. Chicks are good, not gonna lie. No, chicks are good, not gonna lie. What? Milkshakes. Oh, uh, I yeah. Trent saw your yeah. um Encore Videos account, and he said you're, you look clap. I, I look clap, Wow. How did he even find it? That's what I'm wondering. Oh, I told him. This. Oh. oh, hey. Can you send that to me, by the way? No. Send it to me, Viz. I, I currently need to private all the videos. Send it to me, Viz. Send it now, 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 now. Privating every video with my face. No. Private illegal. every video and just do a rebrand. Illegal, illegal, yeah. illegal, illegal. If you private it before I'm, I'm I get gonna... to see, if you so private what are you it, do with if, you private, music account? if you private it before I, I get know. to see, then you're homophobic. Well, I'm still privating it. If you private it before I get to see, you're homophobic. Uh, I am pretty homophobic. You're homophobic anymore. and racist. I am. Indeed. You're homophobic, racist, and sexist. Yeah, I'm not privating against, my against super... men. You're sexist against I'm... men. Your own I'm gender. gonna private every single video that isn't like really good views. So like if it gets under like, cause it has 300 subs, right? Everything with under 300 views is getting privated. So every video. So every video. No, I have a Brawlhalla video. In Brawlhalla and Prodigy, that's all that's gonna stay on my channel. And videos without my face. <laughs> no, I want to see your shout out videos. They're fire. They're amazing. They're fire, bro. They're not fire. They're PewDiePie versus T Series Two is godly. It's just, yeah. it's just my videos racing for views with my cringe face in the thumbnail. Yes. I should have yes. never I found been thirteen. Videos. I found videos. Yeah, but I'm currently no, crying. Must download. All must God. download. Shout out day. Yes, I got shout out day. <laughs> I'm downloading it. I don't even care. <laughs> the most. Can you see here? So oh my god. No. <laughs> yes! No. Yes! No. Yes! I'm giving a shout out to Henry no. DeBead. Henry DeBead! Henry DeBead! <laughs> hey yo, what's up? Henry DeBead. And Lame Boy, I, forgot, I don't know how to say it. Yeah, blame boy. Henry DeBead, no, in particular. Henry DeBead, bro. No, I can't download it. No. Haha. Uh -huh. Get hecked. You should let him download it, bro. Unbe. No, I'm priming everything. You like new intro? Like if I should keep it? Also, I like. Oh, you can. You can. Con beast. You can have that one. I don't care. We'll suggest ideas with a completely different person other than Encore. Hello, everybody. It's Con beast. No. That's my I friend. forgot your name, even though you told me it. Yeah, it was Con Beast. But it was like a C? Con Beast was my name. Oh, Connor. Okay. Yeah, my name's Connor. But, like, Pogo really... stuff. Shout Pogo out. Stuff. More shout out. I like your shout out videos. Yeah, shout out. <laughs> Ditto. Con Beast. Oh Why is there music God. in the background? <laughs> Because I was trying to be like an editor, right? I was trying to be like a cool editor guy, and editors put music in their in their things. And I thought if you put music in there, it's cool. How do you spell? But not so loud. I didn't know how to control the volume on the, at the time. How do you spell con beast? I don't know. I have no clue. How do you spell? C o n b e a s t. C o n b e a s t. Damn. So I have to look. Not the. Encore. 
Encore videos, I no. found it. Let's go. Yeah. No, no. Fuck. 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 Yeah, I can't even hear you. Fuck. God damn it. You found you're talking you're making it. like a whole Yo. Deleting is zero point zero 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 one seconds. Okay, I need to ask you. Um, Encore, I need to ask you. Sad day. What? What? I skipped ahead. I skipped ahead in this video, and I just see fucking sad day in the chat. Hold on, I'll send okay, so it. What's your question? I'll send it in general. I what's just skip question? ahead and I see this. <laughs> Bro, this even you look like anymore. a yeah. four-year-old. <laughs> yeah, I was I mean, that was, born, that, so. was uh, the, that was two years ago, which is like three years. <laughs> yeah, so I was like... I was like Sad four, day. Okay. What's up? I good. <laughs> no, I good. Video, I'm disappointed in you. Oh no, you didn't. Okay, Encore, I need to day. ask you if this is intentional, okay? Wait, okay. hold on. Can I read this off first? Sad day. Yes. What's up? I good. Listen to Pokemon Go or Lil Pump. Yay. <laughs> I will give a video to someone if they give one dollar. If you if you give me a dollar, I'll give you my entire <laughs> No, I won't. That's a joke. But I need to get rid of all these videos of my cringe, like, 12-year-old face. Mm. I know, I, I could just say this, but I want to type it. Yeah, it's a little bit better. Right, wait, keep it. So I don't have a 15-year-old face anymore. Do you, uh, no, no, okay, I need to ask you, okay, look here, duration. how to level up faster in Prodigy Part 1. Okay? Okay. okay. Was the thumbnail intentional? What what about the thumbnail? Was intentional. Sixty nine. Yeah, that was That was intentional. Yeah. Sixty nine okay, no, with no, a no, pog I, face right next to it. Technically, it wasn't. <laughs> yeah. Technically, it wasn't because that was a level in Prodigy that I was. But like, I realized it like the day I uploaded it. Like, oh yeah, sixty nine funny number. So I kept it. I was gonna change it. Well, like, sixty nine funny number. So it wasn't intentional. It it, it, it wasn't this. intentional. But then it was intentional. So I'm saving it. There. It's now care. permanently. I'm, I just took a screenshot. I took a screenshot of it. I took yeah, a screenshot I don't care. of it. I need to private everything. This is embarrassing. So. I'm downloading I I got... part one. Oh, you need to keep everything. Secret Allier editing footage. Oh, that one's fire. I thought one of my best. Oh, it's videos. private now. Haha. <laughs> Get fucked. No. Oh, it's still shout out. Shout out to still thing. Yeah, I know. I'm I'm looking okay. for it. I'm. Is he here? <laughs> so oh, before I'm see. downloading it. I'm downloading it. I'm downloading it. You're, download it. Yeah. Dude, you're gonna get. Uh, you guys are gonna get like three of my videos downloaded that I actually I care mean, about, yeah. and that's three too many. And <laughs> what if we upload them? Convert them. Please don't. Please don't. Convert. Can convert. Convert. Come. Convert. Come on. 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 Yes. Come okay. On, I download it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I got this, 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 I got this. Download. What's high? It was just me saying high. Hi. Saving that. Well, it's gonna waste your time, so that's good. You can waste your time on a video, I don't care. Shout out Sunday is getting removed. No! I love shout out Sunday! Well, it's gone. Fuck you. I'm going to kill you. Right, come on, come on! Download, convert. download all the shout out videos. You will never. All convert, the shout. Convert, convert, I like convert. how this is pure visual. <laughs> you, you guys don't even see anything. You just hear two random guys. Five hundred views. Work in progress. Small update. Huh. A name change. You, you went through a lot of those. Yeah, I went through. Favorite channel. Videos. I'm changing. Oh, that Thank was not you. a puberty video, by the Small way. Small shout out video. Short stream, a frequent question, what should I do? Announcement, fan More group laughing, name, baby. <laughs> 175 subscribers, very first stream, 500 views, again. Mm. Work in progress, small update, random Yugo videos, I don't know. Yugo. 100 subscribers, VR 25 subscribers. VR headset giveaway?
I was giving away what? some random VR headset I found. It was like my friend gave me it. It was, it was one of those ones that you put your phone into. It was garbage, and I was just like, "What if I get some views off this?" So did you it. actually you give, it, give away? it away? Yes, I actually did. I, but here's the thing: a lot of random people answered, but a lot of people from my school answered. So I only picked people from my school to win. So I didn't <laughs> do any <shit. laughs> asshole. That's why. I, that's why if I ever did one, I would uh, what's it called? Called. I would want to do like V bucks or something like All right, that. Small TV. shout out video is getting removed now. I got I got a video. Eat it. You bitch. got a singular video. Oh, first stream has the best thumbnail. I'm keeping it. What? Whatever. Very first stream has the best thumbnail. Yeah. Frequent question. I have to get your name. I love how I get this this picture. I pause on this on this face. <laughs> oh my god, I fucking hate you too. I'm gonna, I'm gonna send this to you. I'm gonna send this in general, and you are going to hate me. I'm going to probably. I already do hate you, but whatever. <laughs> but I land on this face. Let me see. Let me see. <laughs> Hold on, wait. Okay, I hate you. I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, wait. Too. I'm gonna see if I can do the funnies and actually just hold on, wait. I'm just gonna. I have to keep privating videos. I'm, I'm almost. I'm not even close to done. What the hell am I talking about? Memes. I'm never gonna do this. Intro. We're gonna, we're gonna get a whole videos. How to grow a YouTube channel? Gaming. I have to get rid of that. It didn't get views. <laughs> <laughs> How do you? No, the, the thumbnail is godly. It's just before a random picture of a mm, dead apartment, okay. and then after a diamond play one. New editing. Thanks. <laughs> Okay. New editing, thanks. And I, I acted like I was getting money off this. I am not getting money off this, yeah. and I probably never will, oh, unless I start I spamming out. I should start spamming out videos. Like just make like ten videos. I'm making money. Be an ex McQuax. Well, I'm going to. Yeah, I'm gonna sure. be an ex McQuax. Okay. Okay. So, um, <laughs> everyone watching the video right now, you can now see on screen. The picture that me and Encore and me Viz and me and Viz were laughing about, and the one that he just sent. Yes, <laughs> it's really on screen right now. I am moving it around. It is the funny fat, f basically square face with a square glass. <laughs> so I don't have a square face anymore, by the way. <laughs> well, too bad. I'm Wait, still are you actually putting it. it on there? Because I don't think Encore wants his face out there, or does he just um, not care? Here's the thing, right? My there. face looks really different, so it's like you can reveal my old face. I don't care. It's all, I do all, care. It's already it's up there. It's, I mean, I still know what your face looks like because I have your I TikTok. Deleted it. My it, it it looks different from my TikToks. It's now off of it, but it was on there. All right, well, Just put it on there for like have... a split second. No, I but he had to move it around. Was moving it around. My fat fucking. Square face. <laughs> <laughs> I like face. how what? I said. I like how I said square face, and now you're going along with a square face. Because More I do have baby. a square fucking face. You can watch the laughing baby videos. They're just my brother. Con Conbees. Con bees. Con bees. Ock. Encore video, oh. or. Con beast. You should be you should be encore videos. No, I'm never going to be doing that ever. I need to just once I can get rid of all my videos, sure. <laughs> I'm back was it? five months ago. <laughs> yeah. He just made a whole bunch of those. He made a series of those. Am back. I coming back? The comeback of Beastly? <laughs> Specifically Beastly? I'm back, Given comma number. exclamation mark. <laughs> <laughs> Am I though? Am I back? White on white <laughs> violence. Damn, it's snowing. <laughs> That's what I did to come back. Do you like it? Am I back? Am I back? Question mark, exclamation mark, question mark, exclamation mark. <laughs> whatever that is, asterisk or whatever. What does he say? Question mark, asterisk thing? Explaining yeah. some things. <laughs> Do you like these titles? I made them myself. They're epic. <laughs> What's up? You are a true YouTuber with the I'm back. I'm coming back soon. Yeah. Okay, I'm so quitting I'm YouTube. 
I click on the no, I I click on the I'm back one, and the first video that's recommended is I'm quitting YouTube. Dot dot dot. Yeah, I did quit YouTube. Action. You went to What are you gonna do with the Encore Music's channel if you're gonna post your music on the? I'm not posting Encore. my music on here. This channel is full of five year olds. Not okay, play. so you're gonna post your music. So you can have a music channel and a normal channel. No, I'm gonna have a music Con channel. Beast, channel. yo. <laughs> Another one of the YouTube channels named Con Be No, your other chan. Wait, hold on. Is wait, hold on. Wait, what channel? But he has a he has an he has an other other channel. He has. I have like fifty channels. Hold I had on, like wait. fifty channels when I was younger. Hold on, wait. Like, like I'm a billion looking. Channels. Wait, hold on. Shut up. I'm looking. Real quick no, to I'm see not be shutting up. Shut up, fatty. I'm not the fatty, I'm the fatty. Shut up, fatty. You, know, Viz you had looking like a patty. Viz is the I fatty. Did have the fat. Actually, Viz is the fatty. I'll yeah, you let you ice know. My doctor it. said I was underweight. Okay, but you value ice cream over rent, like actual people. So yeah, you're you're fatty. You're a fatty. New Twitch. No, it's what? private. Clash Royale, free gems and legendaries. Parentheses. Try not to do parentheses. <laughs> so basically, basically for that video, right? If you um, it's it's basically you contact Supercell and say, "Hey, right. bitch, give me diamonds." I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck! I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm, gonna get rid of that. I'm keeping. I'm keeping this. No, you're not. No, <laughs> you are not. I already you copy and pasted it. No, it's fine. <laughs> T series bad is in the middle my of other is yes, under my I have other downloaded. channels. I have successfully downloaded um Super Wizard Battle. <laughs> this is just Encore getting scared because no, I'm not scared. I just I, I just I'm annoying. You just don't want it. You T series don't want bad. It's, Where is T series bad? I need to look this up. T it's his bad. other. It's his other channel, and it's under pop oh, yeah, under the me. popular videos and. It, it doesn't have any videos on it, but it does. No, it has. It. No, it still does. I'm quitting it's YouTube. What brand, videos? It's brand new Arf, intro. Arf Software. Three years ago. Oh, yeah, that's a fire. Arf, Arf Software. I'm back. Am I coming back? Oh, no. I'm quitting YouTube. Mm -hmm. Vlogs are back. I fell off a switch. <laughs> I'm back. I love that video. Am I coming yeah. back? Watch, I fell off Actually, coming back yeah. to YouTube. I'm though... back? Even no though chromosome versus low food. even though why am I violent? Stand up in my back. What did Fish, she say? Fuck up anyone wants to talk. Even though yeah. Encore did yeah. private, even though Encore did private the intro, the one that one of them that I remember seeing on the channel, and I looked in the channel, like you know, one of the playlists, and it said it had the first the video the intro that's also on this Conbeast channel that was in the discussion tab. Yeah, it's this is also one of Encore's um accounts. Encore's. Well, Encore's. 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 Encore's other X TikTok. Two. So. Fuck my TikTok. X TikTok. No TikTok. Two point sixty nine. Ha! Gamer time by oh, Searcher thirty four by Searcher sixty fourth. Not funny. Not funny. Didn't laugh. Yeah, I did not laugh at you. Okay, well, guess what? I, I downloaded the Super Wizard Battle, so I what's a, yeah. what's a hero? What's a Waluigi? What's a me brawler? What's a <laughs> what's an Among Us? What's a Steve? What's a Goku? Goku and Goku? What's a Super Mario Thirty Five? What's a Wario? <laughs> you must pay the monkey visit meme original. How Thanos got out of the Shadow Realm? Parentheses not not clickbait. What's a cloud? Not, not What's a cloud? S 64 sub special. Under cards, but I'm determined to win. Cake Wars, but it's my first time. What's this a Lucario? Me. What's a Vegito? I have not. I, this is not me. I know it's not, but I think it's funny that this channel. Like, this channel actually does have a. Um. What's your. Um. That person actually does have a, um, um, I feel like this one is actually a pretty fire video, not gonna lie. I find it funny how there's one video called 
25 subscriber special. And then the next video is 100 subscribers. Okay, there was a video in between. Actually, there was like 50 videos in between. But, um, I, no, actually, there, there wasn't that many videos in between. But I think I, I've provided enough videos that I'm satisfied. Actually, no, nah, there's no. Like, I don't care. This person Full of suggest ideas with your friend in yeah. the thumbnail. Yeah, this searcher sixty fourth person actually does have, actually does have a screen recorder that they um uh, not a screen recorder. Fuck, I meant a capture card that for the switch that they use. And I find that funny because like no subscribers with a switch capture card for some reason. Well, two hundred and thirty, okay. but like still. Um. I well. Did did I mean, Encore just get long. yelled at? No, no that was worse. I mean, um, fuck, my, I'm sorry. Wait, question mark. Viz, oh did yeah, you just that get was a video about rice. Thing. Viz, why did you just get yelled at? Because I have to leave. Have to leave to go where? To sleep. It's 9 p.m. By yeah. that, I mean I'm gonna I'm gonna watch TV. Oh. Okay. oh. Wait, are, do you literally have to leave? Yeah, I'm gonna stay on for like two and then for a little this. bit more though. Right here, rice gum. Rice gum. <laughs> this stick is really emo. Seventy-one peeps. <clears throat> What happened? Your guess is as um, good as What happened? Your guess is as good as mine. Why is Roman Atwood there? Because he was on the top subscribe channel. Ew. Roman Atwood bad. Roman yeah, why is Rice going to have three subscribers, 13, no, three videos, 13 subscribers, and uh, 71 views? I don't know. Ask Social Blade. Don't ask me. <laughs> your guess is as good as mine, dude. Uh, ask gosh. Social Blade. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Well, um, I'm looking at videos of mine that have copyright claims, and damn, I'm scrolling through. Guess how many of them are raps? 13 subscribers. Yeah, didn't you do a lot of, like, parodies or whatever? No, just guess. Just guess how many of them are raps. Like... Three views Half. in the last. Three all. Oh, all on the damn. first page are raps. G. And one of them <laughs> is not. Why? Well, I wasn't paying attention to a single thing you just said. I was too busy downloading videos. What, what video are you downloading exactly? My last video that I downloaded was um. Uh, Luckily, you guys didn't get enough battle. videos for me to care. Actually, you guys got a lot of videos. But whatever. Um, um, Andy got more, but I got the most. But I got the better video. What what videos did you get? Andy? Out of curiosity, I got the the prodigy one. Well, the prodigy one wasn't getting deleted. Eh, well, I still got it. Uh -oh. I, I mean, it probably will get deleted within like a month. I didn't. Oh. I didn't get it. I, I, I already went because I got this video. You get the super wizard battle. Look in general. Look. No, don't look in general. <laughs> I already, already halfway uploading. The video is terrible. Yeah, this video, so I win. I look hella different. I love my editing, though. My editing is what brings it all together. <laughs> but shoot, alright, I'm gonna kill you. you I love my right fire. Claim. I love my fire beam that just goes like behind my hand. Hold on, wait, what? <laughs> Pretty girl? Huh? Funny. No, I, I love my blood. <laughs> my oh, blood is that was from... <laughs> That's from someone else, okay. <laughs> Jesus I love Christ. that explosion that like explodes randomly in the in his face and and then the other guy gets affected. <laughs> No. <laughs> and then the blood splatter. Oh, I like how he just spray like a tiny bit of blood. <laughs> yeah, literally all of them. Oh, yo, that was, well, that was a nice sound effect. I, <laughs> I should remake that video. I might remake that video. <laughs> yeah. Yes, we you're probably in like, one. All of them, except for three, are um 
<laughs> All of them except for. <laughs> Shut up. Stop playing that. What please. was that? <laughs> Stop playing that, please. <laughs> ah! I'm trying to Mute talk. This. Okay, bye. I, I must go. Okay, okay bye. bye Fatty. Did yeah, you leave? Stupid. No. Uh, I will let you know, I was underweight. Fat. Yeah, okay, fatty. Fat ass. <laughs> fat ass bitch. Um, so, what I find really, like, one of them is Random Edits 4 Feature Length Edition, right? And mm -hmm. somehow, it's copyright owner's policy says that it's monetized in some territories, but it's completely blocked on mobile. Like, you can't watch it at all during mobile. Outside my window. You can't watch the video at all on mobile. And it's because funny... Funny, um... Because I made funny, uh... Put on funny, uh... What is it, um... Fuck, no, I'm trying to... Did it snow where you live? No, I put in funny Looney Tunes. Okay, but did it snow where you live? No. Wow, it snowed where I live. Uh -huh. I, don't, I don't think it did, anyways. Oh, and Wait, the how do you other. Not know? I I haven't looked outside. <laughs> and then another one is literally just funny Rick Roll that, for some reason, didn't get the video taken down. Even though. Um, another video, um, I think it was, yeah, it was Random Edits 3 that got, um, Random Edits, like, 3, or, like, yeah, Random Edits 3. I like how this is still here. Damn. <laughs> Hold on, wait, we should probably, we should probably mute Fizz. You can cut that out, right? I don't uh, think he wants his video to get I don't, I don't know. Probably doesn't. He told me he doesn't. Okay. Um, I don't well, know. He's muted. I'll, I'll, I'll cut. I'll cut it out somehow. Um. Um. He anyways, what? there. That's. Yeah, that's for the better. Mm -hmm. Um. Anyways. Um. Like, cause random edits three, got taken. Was like completely taken down. Like I couldn't even upload it. That's how, like, bad it was, basically. And so I'm kind of surprised that random edits, because of a longer edit, because of a longer, um, funny... I like how it was... So the edit was actually supposed to be a, like, the PewDiePie N-word clip, but with the to-be-continued music. And so it goes, what a fucking, and then it just, dan it, dan it, it, dan it, Oh, yeah, I've seen that yeah. before. Like, I made, I made it, I made one, but the video got taken down because <laughs> the dan it, dan it, it, dan it, yeah, that, that song. That was copyright. Yeah, and so it got taken, wow. it got taken down, like, wow. entirely, so I had to make it, like, a lot shorter because of that because that was one of the memes in it and the video just... yeah i really want i really want a snow day to happen but like it clearly won't <laughs> yeah it's almost like there's one we can just there. learn from home and two there isn't enough snow i heard something on the news about how snow days might get called just more for like the childhood experience or whatever and it's funny how like two of the fucking two out of the, like the Five random edits videos are claimed. Wow. I have copyright claims on them because, well, um, music. Music. And visual. Music and visual. Because I can't believe you talked about this. Oh, yeah. Um, also, what I find, um, if I can find it, real, if I can find it. If I can find the song, I'll show you something. Uh, hold on, wait, what? Okay, hold on. So there's that one. I really hate my parents right now. It's, it's nothing against them. It's against the school. Huh. Like, why the fuck are we doing work during a global fucking pandemic? 
I get we have to learn and shit, but we, why now? Oh. Yeah, bitch, we I get that some people ready. can learn at home, but some people Wait, can't. Look at me, cause you and I know some people can't, because some people, I, I, like some people are my friends and I've talked to them. Mm -hmm. And they most definitely cannot be working out. Um, so what I find funny is, um, if I do look at it, I believe it's two totally separate things, unless I'm wrong. Um, I'm just looking at it real quick, just to make sure. No, it's not. Oh well. But, what I do find funny, actually, is the fact that, is that, um, the, is that both the private unlisted one, that I s version of War Ready that I sent to Lil Yeet and the public version have both they both have claims by the same th person but like somehow they're totally different parts that are claimed that's interesting it's it's interesting basic it's very interesting Wait, this one has a copyright claim? So my friend copied me has a copyright claim? Wait, what? Wait, for what? Okay, let's listen. Are you kidding me? The most, like, free-to-use song that I've ever heard. Yeah. A song that's literally, like... <clears throat> I've gotten claimed for that I do use that I got claimed for zero times before I get claimed for somehow that makes sense doesn't it encore yeah, and that makes a lot of sense I'm fucking dying that's epic you should die less well see if you tell my teachers that what? The fuckers are giving me like nine assignments a day. Mm. And it's in a global pandemic time, and they say they're giving us less work when they clearly aren't. I hate school. Yeah, who doesn't? I actually have to go, like, to the school. I'd rather go to the school at this point. But, like, I don't. Like Hello. And no, no one likes going to school, but at this point, I'd prefer it. I'd prefer I prefer being online, honestly. I prefer working it's, at home. Yeah, it, it's just how people learn, and I cannot learn at home. It's something I can adapt to, it's not something I can do. Yeah. Especially with that, you know, have you heard, like, the whole gifted kid burnout thing or whatever? Um, the what? It's, it's where, like, the smart kids back in elementary school... Um, slowly start to realize that they aren't as smart. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of me right now. So I'm in, I'm in like honors classes in high school. I'm still like smart, which is like thing is I'm smart still. I can still catch on to subjects really fucking easily, and yet I just choose not. I know this is gonna I, sound I, I, really I, stupid, but like I just choose not to. Like, my brain just thing, chooses not to learn, and that's what I find really funny. The thing is, for it's me, right, I'm, I can learn in, a subject. I'm in honors program, but, like, somehow... Just... I'm in, like, honors classes, right, and I can understand the material. Fuck. That's the honors, problem. Honors, uh, yeah, I'm in honors class classes, specifically but, like, math. I can't do my homework, I just... Home is not a work environment. Home that's, is that's sleep, true. sleep and work. And when I have study hall, that makes shit even worse. Because like at study hall, I'm actually doing work. In in like seventh and eighth grade, I used my study hall pretty well. I would get all my work done. But like now, fuck no. At home study hall, I use that as a break to take a fucking nap. Uh. Since I have like a study hall and then lunch break. Mm. It's weird talking about school, like online school, but like it's not. It's not. 
It's very weird just hearing about it because personally it could never be my school specifically that just my school specifically that does that. It's more of just work on the things on your own because no. Because yes. In like you know how when the pandemic started, right? And um you would like it started in you know, like people like lockdown started in March. Generally the school for most people started around April. Mm-hmm. Like online school. I could do that because it was asynchronous and like I was doing it on my own time. Mm-hmm. But now I have an online fucking lunch period. Like that's not a thing. That should not be a thing. Wait. Even in that period I was maintaining like bees. Actual online lunch period? No, 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 no. But like a time where I'm supposed to eat lunch. What? Like, okay. I don't know. I, you know, and like, I feel like I'm supposed to be eating lunch at that time. Because it's, you know, on a, it's technically at school. Even though at school there is an, an eight-foot Christmas tree, a TV, and a computer within, like, five feet. Okay, that's really fucking confusing to me now. Because... I'm looking at, I'm still on my channel analytics, you know, mm-hmm. and I'm looking at last 48 hours, you know, Mocha X video, 706 within last, you know, hour, for tw- 48 hours, but when you look at its views, that's not really surprising, and then for some goddamn reason, right up there, like right up there, for some ri- God knows what reason, the Sansa Papyrus video that I made in fucking 2016, in July, July 2016, has gotten 153 within the last two days. I mean, that video went viral. That it did, but like, why is it still getting views? Viral videos get views. Yeah, but not this long after. Fair. At least they shouldn't. Cause I know. I still remember the fucking Bed and Cheers song. That shit was a bop. That is a bop. Up there with that name drop song. Oh my damn, or whatever. Yeah. I was bumping that shit in like fifth grade. Back when I was making those cringe ass videos in fifth and sixth mm-hmm. and seventh grade. Mm-hmm. That was very cringe. Um, let's see. Yeah, my comedy has been the same four or five months. If I check my, um, Social Blade, since private videos get their, um, views removed from Social Blade, dude, my views are gonna drop, like, thousands. That's, yeah. Also, I looked oh, back at my um I looked back at my video that I made a long long time ago. Like like way before ETX community shit, like way before that. If you want to get a real like just like real, you know, show on how long ago this was. Then um um the... I need a little Zan song. No, if you want to get a real look at how long, long ago it was, it's like 2018, 2017. Yeah, it's a 2018, 2017. Yeah, it's a 2018 video. And it's called Endy's Best Edits. And I look at, like, most of the edits and the comedy in them, and I, I watch it, and I'm like, oh... Wow, my comedy has not changed that much for like three years. So, Encore, are you still alive? Uh, no, I am not alive. You didn't talk after I told that thing and I was just like, is he okay? (laughs) I'm barely alive right now. I have like a bunch of schoolwork to do that I don't want to do. If I don't do it, I get grounded. And like I can't, I can't do it because home is bad. So I'm, I'm like conflicted with what I want to do. Mm. 
should probably. Um, I mean, this podcast. This podcast already is like three hours and fourteen minutes. So like, it'd be uh, fine if we just like, ended it here. If you really needed it to. Not gonna get me to do my schoolwork. Why? Cause I'm not gonna do it. You should do it. I should. I know I should, but I just, I just do it. Can't do it. No. Do it. Fuck. Fuck you. Do it. It takes me an hour to do an assignment that should take ten minutes. Do no. it. No. Do it. No. Do it. Fuck you. Damn. All right. I'm gonna start bullying you instead of his. No. Bully you know, viz, viz. Bully you. viz. Bully viz. If you right. bully me, you're kicked. Fine, fuck Viz. All my homies hate Viz. Yeah, fuck Viz. All my homies va- hate Viz. We should have been bullying Equinox. Damn, I've really had these blonde highlights for that long. Damn, alright. I look back at my like videos from like eight months ago with face cam, you know, and I have the blonde highlights in those. Which means I've had these, and I still have them. Which means I've had them for like eight months. Damn. Damn. Same blonde highlights too, like exact same. I haven't gotten new highlights or whatever. No, it's the exact same. I've had these for eight months, at the very least, bro. Yeah, I've had these for. Maybe nine? Actually, maybe nine, because I'm looking at the live stream and I'm really looking at my hair in the live stream and I'm. Yeah, actually. I know probably... a life hack I can do. Yeah, actually, nine. Damn. No, I, I know a life hack I can do, though. What? So, since my mom's almost guaranteed taking my phone away for the weekend, since I'm not. I'm just not able. I'm just physically not able to do all my work. Right, mm-hmm. I have another phone that was um. It was like, not it was it, it's LTE got disabled, but I can still use it. I just don't know where it is. Mm. And if I find that, I'll use that maybe. Maybe. My mom, I don't know. I don't. She What's doesn't it? get that school is impossible online, and she can't. She can't get that because she didn't have school online. Yeah, fair. So when I tell her online school is tough, she's like, "Oh, you should still be doing it. It's, it's the second night. It's the second. Um, this it's the second nine weeks." And I'm like, "Yeah, I know. I should be, but it's not something you just adapt to like that." Yeah, that's true. And yeah, until my mom's never gonna realize that, but. It, it, like I, I'm, I feel like I'm stalling almost until you know I'm actually in school because there's like a vaccine maybe, but yeah. At the What's same really time, crazy. what can I do? What's really crazy is that there's gonna be a vaccine, <coughs> and thing is, we don't even What's know that? if it'll work. Well, it says it has a decent effective effect rate or whatever. Well. Again, we don't know if it'll, like, fully, full-on work, so. Yeah, if it's, it could just be placebo. Yeah. I don't know, I just, I I can't physically do work at home, and my teachers, they, they kind of get it, but at the same time, they don't do anything about it. Yeah. They're like, yeah, we get that you can't do anything at home. There's another eight assignments that we have for you to do. Well, I don't know what's really just like... Just, I find something I just really find funny about um, my videos. What? Is, well, specifically Sands of Papyrus Play Minecraft. It's that I had five videos before it, and that's my sixth video. Sands of Papyrus Play Minecraft. It's my sixth upload ever.
And okay, but Hip Hop Boy's rhyme schemes are fire. I check my inbox. You want to be on this cipher? You're still changing diet groups. What? Nothing. Oh, say it again. Hip Hop Boy has the best rhyme schemes in the game. I check my inbox. You want to be on the cipher? People are still changing their diapers. That's true. That's fire. I still have a diaper on. That's fire. Hip Hop Boy is basically like. Jade is basically the new Hip Hop Boy, I feel like. The thing is, there's no one that will ever be like Hip Hop Boy. I like how J Mode's carried Hip Hop Boy through that whole beef. Uh -huh. Like, without J Mode, his Hip Hop Boy would have been extinct after Sheep Sound. Definitely. Taco. I get the chips and cheese like nachos. Chris Boy, give me like a taco. <sighs> That's weird. Really and weird. Taco. That's weird. I'm looking at the channel things, and now I'm seeing um, uh, uh, things for um, ads that I didn't used to be able to see because now I'm actually eligible for ads. Right. And so that's what I find, like, really, really just odd because now, although I'm able to, it still feels weird that I'm able to ads. Damn, that's a lot of hidden users. Damn. Why is Charlotte's subbot hidden? What the fuck? Wait, what? I'm looking at hidden users. Is Miles scared to be subbed to you? No, I'm just literally looking at, like, there's a little thing that says, just shows hidden users, and I'm looking at the hidden users, and for some reason, some people are just hidden that I, and I don't know why. Oh! I like, I I'm looking at my channel, right? My monthly views were like, okay, so 1,200, 1,600, 1,500, negative 1,000, 1,300, 1,600, 1,900, 300, 800, and then whatever I'm going to lose right now. Oh, God. Hold on, I remember that guy. Hold on, wait. Hold on, wait, I'm going to look at that real quick. On normal yeah, fucking, fucking, I don't know. I'm gonna I don't know what to fuck. do. Maybe I just get my work done for like the rest of the week and it'll like soften the blow. I don't know. Mm. I'm quite literally out of options right now. Mm. Like, I'm still gonna lose my phone, but at least my grade won't be that heavily affected. I don't even care about my grades anymore. I know I really should because I could be repeating ninth grade, but like, the fuck are they supposed oh, to do? It's, yeah. it's a year with a schooling system no one can get used to. Yeah. Are they just gonna be like, oh yeah, we're counting that by the way? Yeah. So um, I remember this guy called Inked, this person Inked artist, like. A while ago, it just started like, like started beefing with me in my comments, and then they said they're gonna make a rant on me, and then I just barely <laughs> now remembered about them, and guess what? They made mm. nothing. <laughs> Liar. Bro, but the Russian Hub Premium rant was kind of fire. Huh. Russian Hub Premium kind of stupid. Not gonna lie. You remember Russian Hub Premium? I don't. When we were on the call with Gacha Kai. Oh, yeah. 
And we were spam banging him. And then he made a rant video because of it. Oh, yeah. What I video was really stupid. What I find super funny is that if I just search up Andy, then I see a bunch of stuff. And yet, like... Half of the... No, literally, like, most, if not all, are literally just not by me. Mm -hmm. Because, I don't know. Fuck, dude. I'm about to get gray hairs in fucking high school. Same. If they're caused by stress, then I'm definitely getting gray hairs in high school. Same. Most definitely, actually. You know, if we weren't online, I'd probably be doing great in school. I'd probably be having, like, high Bs, low As, and everything. We, but I got off on the wrong foot for the first nine weeks, and I just can't get oh, off. Yeah, Russian Hub Premium. They literally made a ran. Yeah, it's I worthless. It's... <laughs> you see, they made it like a few weeks ago. <laughs> Sorry, I'm looking at the comments, and one of the top comments is, Congratulations, you finally got over 40 views. It's in three months because of Andy. <laughs> that sounds like a sin comment. Was that soon? No, that was um, Mr. Anonymous. Oh. Uh, he's pretty epic. Yeah. He said, A, let's get it. I just finessed 86 views and I chased Clout. Literally only got 92 views off of my name and he knows it. But thing is, he says he finessed, but like, in all reality, he was actually pissed. Mm hmm So, him saying he finessed it is totally a lie. He was actually legitimately pissed. Dude, he was mad for pings. That's like a Vorbis move right there. Except for like, Vorbis wouldn't even do this. Vor yeah, Vorbis wouldn't ex um, uh, He yeah. wouldn't. Vorbis was gonna diss you over pings. Yeah, but like, I am so influential. I'm so gamer that he, that, uh, he didn't. Yeah, that took a lot of convincing from probably multiple people. Yeah. My my most notable comment in that whole thing was, do you really want to lose a friendship over pings? Yeah, that's... that's. Mm. That sounds kind of not gamer. Yeah. Gosh, hi. I'm about to fucking die. Bro, that's epic. Do I care, though? I should... I should die, not gonna lie. Hello, my lovely fans. Oh yeah, I remember this one. Ah, I'm looking at the X Mocha X isn't funny. Dot 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 three. Oh, by Gotcha Kai, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, <I'm> <laughs> Someone's actually pissed. Someone is gonna... actually pissed. Wait, hold on. Someone is actually pissed. I literally just said epic on the video. And someone said, bro, you're such a bad creator. You're not giving criticism to Mocha, which, first off, you don't have to give criticism for fucking anything. You yeah. are allowed to express your opinions, goddammit. You don't have to be yeah. constructive. It's still criticism. It's just that everyone thinks that constructive criticism is just normal criticism, and that's fucking dumb thinking. Yeah. Anyways. Fuck. You're not giving criticism to Mocha. You're trying to judge your, as in possessive, not you are, for both the yours. You're trying to judge a 13-year-old girl for expressing herself and showing her sense of humor. People have different senses of humor, and <laughs> no, that's just no. And see, thing is, everyone that's um, subscribed... 
that basically knows that um, everything just somehow, all the time, whenever I say something in comments, it just gets um, fucking, just, it just becomes like a meme. Literally. Mm -hmm. Like, literally, I was the first one to just comment epic, and then everyone comments an epic. Then everyone else just commented epic. Every and then on like the viewer. Didn't Gacha kind of make another video? Um, or so, someone did. And um, Greasy commented epic, and I'm pretty sure everyone's like, that's not funny anymore. <laughs> <laughs> they just flame Greasy. Yeah. But it's funny how whenever I do it, it's whenever I say just something like epic, everyone's just like, well, time to say epic. And whenever it's someone sweet. else... And whenever someone else does it, it's like, fucking cringe. Greasy has a lot of influence, so it's okay. Greasy hasn't <laughs> posted in three months. <laughs> Sounds like influence to me. On his main channel. Yeah, on his music channel, he has Headless Horseman and nothing else. Yeah, and what's funny about Headless Horseman is that, um, hey, guess what? My verse was low fucking quality because he can't <laughs> fucking figure out how to fucking do shit. He can't figure out how to just fucking save the audio. You know, you know it's a big shocker. What? Chronic hates Greasy and thinks that Greasy carried you on it. It's fucking damn. It's recorded. To be fair, Chronic hates you with a passion. He he just kind of like. Low key hates crazy. Yeah. Like, Chronics made it painfully clear that he hates you. Yep. <laughs> he loves hating me. That's his passion. That's what's doing. That's what he wants to do when he grows up. He wants to hate me. Just everyone, everyone gets normal jobs and he just hates you. Yep. Why do I have subs. Why do. Huh? What? Hold on, wait. I'm just gonna look at a live camera. So, I'll just explain to you right now how many people with above a thousand subscribers have... How many people are subscribed to me and they have above a thousand subscribers? So, let's Where? see. I'm just gonna count out loud here. Ready? Mm-hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty four. And guess how many of those have more subscribers than me? Figure like 11. Um, let's see if you're right. One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, hold on. I need to recount. My brain just forgot where I was. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, wait, is that right? Is it, did you actually guess it on the dot? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Jeez. Guess how many of them have over 20,000? Uh, four. One, two, three, four, five. Damn. Guess how many of them have over 26,000? Four. One, two, three. Three. Well... 
I specifically said over. Well, technically, one of them is. So, technically, you were right, because one is at 26.5. So, technically, you were right. I just thought yeah. that one didn't count, but, you know. Um, so, specifically, three of them are... One of them has... So, the most... The channels that are subscribed to me with the most subscribers, I'll read them off how their subscriber count. 17.5 thousand, 25.3 thousand, 26.5 thousand, 27.4 thousand, 30, 30 point, wait, hold on, 17,500, 25,300, 26,500, 27,400, 30,800, and last one, Fifty three thousand seven hundred. Damn. Those are just like based off of oh, is their subscription oh. public? But like, Damn. actually, that's how many people are subscribed to me. Like <sighs> that amount of subscribers. High amounts. Like it's not a lot, but like, damn. Wait, hold on. I'm fucking tired now. That's epic. Wait, hold on. You can I should sleep like Viz. Even though Viz is stupid fat ass. That's true. That's not what I was gonna do. Hold on. This probably is STDs. That's... yeah. Viz probably got an STD from you. No. From you. Uh, no. How about we both agree? We'll, we'll come to a compromise. We both gave him an STD. Yep. A. And we'll say Trip VZ gave him one too, just so Trip VZ can watch this. Wait, huh? That doesn't seem right. Trip VZ kind of gay, not gonna lie. Hold on, wait. I'm just kind of. Okay, so you're. I'm looking at that. <clears throat> I'm looking at the channel membership thing for your channel, and it says mm -hmm. your channel must have. F oh, more than 5,000 subscribers. Your channel is in the YouTube Partner Program. You're over 18 years old. Ouch. You're located, uh, yeah, you're located in one of the available locations. Your channel is set, is not, wait, huh? Okay, your channel is not set as made for kids. Your channel does not have a significant number of ineligible videos. Well, so that's the 18 thing, and 5,000 subs, you seem pretty clear. Other than the 18 thing. Yeah, you kind of aren't 18. Kind of, I'm not, but like, I kind of really And you kind of like made it. a video saying you're 15. I kind of don't sound like it, and yet somehow... Yes, but you... People still... I kind of am not, and people say that I'm... That I sound like it. I don't even know. I just I just sound however I sound. People say I sound over 18, and I'm like, I think that's an insult or a compliment. I can't tell. When I'm tired, I sound like I'm 50. You don't. <laughs> no, I don't. Apparently, I sound like I'm over 18. Wow. Like in my fucking twenties, apparently. Yeah, you everyone, are in your twenties. Everyone You're making fun to, of a thirteen year old. Everyone tries that. I was gonna say, like, everyone literally <laughs> likes to bring up the fucking ex mocha x's age on me when I'm like not that much older than ex mocha x or ex maquax. It's ex maquax. That's easier to say. Ex maquax, yeah. 
Like when I, I'm like X, they try to bring up Exmo Quax's age, and I'm like, and like, oh, she's thirteen. How could you be making? How could you be criticizing her when she's thirteen? Ah. Like, I'm fifteen. Yeah. What's your point? I'm I'm also fifteen. I'm literally not that much older than her. What is your point? And after I say that, they're like, uh. And surprise, You're surprise. Stupid. And surprise, surprise, they can't come up with anything. Because guess what? They mm-hmm. didn't fucking anticipate me to be this fucking. to be that fucking young. Yeah. I don't know why my mom is so strict about online school. It's kind of annoying. It's online school bad. It's online school, bro. Um... Like, I'd rather, I'd literally rather jerk off to fucking, to a fucking rock. I'd rather stick my dick in a rock than do online school. Fair enough. Can't say I do that, but fair. Like, here's the thing. When I'm at school, I have to do my work. When I'm at home, I'd literally rather do nothing than do my schoolwork. So taking my phone doesn't do anything. Yeah. So I'd rather just do nothing. I don't. I don't see how that's a valid, like, oh, well, since eh, you're not doing your work, it's obviously your phone. I like how most parents don't think on the level of, you know, maybe they just don't like the thing and don't like the environment and then, and then, and it's more... It's, you know something weird? You know something weird? When I went to my grandpa's house, something... I actually got all my work done. Uh, my parents just refuse to take me there when it's clear that I'm doing better there like people like parents just refuse to think on the level of hey maybe it's not the device that I gave my child maybe it's something else that has something to do with whatever go- whatever environment or whatever da 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 that my child maybe it's that online school is hard to adapt to like they they think the oh this is logical because i'm a parent route rather than the oh this is actually logical yeah if they're they're the parent they're the one who they they know more they're more wise or whatever the fuck they're more wise or whatever why do one of the one of the reason like one of the ways to be wise is to see people in your like to go inside someone's skin and walk around in it no. to see things from their perspective no 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 one a way to be more wise is to be in your fucking 40s tell me i'm wrong yeah you can yeah Cause... just just being old can be wise like uh, in your 40s or older that's how you be fucking wise, apparently. Yeah, it's totally not seeing other people's point of view or anything. Yeah. That would just be stupid. Thinking logically, cringe. Yeah, it's kind of kind of cringe. Like, oh, clearly he's not enjoying online school, and he's told me that already. Must be the phone. Ah, it must be the. Even phone. though, again. I'd rather sit on my ass and start spinning around in a wheel, not even a wheelchair, just my computer chair. I'd rather just spin around in a computer chair than do my work. Yeah. Get fucking dizzy and then, like, stay dizzy for, like, five fucking million years. Yeah, I could I could be dizzy for the rest of my life, and I would be, I'd rather do that than do my, my work. <laughs> That would sound... That sounds... Ooh, can we actually talk about how that sounds, though? Yeah, actually. 
Like, being dizzy like that, where, like, everything is permanently, like, side. Spinning. Like, yeah, like, how spinning, that's... And your, your, your balance is gonna get fucked, like, the second you stand up. Well, Like, the second you stand up, you're falling over. Eventually, you'll adapt to it. Cause, yeah, but that's gonna um, take a long time. Yeah, that's true. Like, I remember spinning around for just a minute and being like, hell it is here. Yeah. Now I've tried, I remember like trying some things like that got me dizzy before now and now they don't get me dizzy, which sucks because like, hey, I wanted the experience of being dizzy again because hey, ADHD. If you, um, if you put your head, if you start moving your head in, like, a figure eight form while looking down, it actually feels really weird. Mm. Head starts moving. Like, and then you, like, you move your head in a figure eight form while looking down, and then once you go up, your head's gonna feel real weird. Mm. Um, real, like, real, real, well, I'm, I was gonna say something, and then I forgot, so I was gonna say real dog, and then I fucking forgot what I said. Then I forgot what I was gonna fucking say, so I just <laughs> blew it off. I'm dying. You should probably go to sleep. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna finish my album, and then I'm gonna disappear from the world. No. Fake my death, move to Tuvalu, live a life there. No. I'm gonna rent beach chairs to people. No. I. I'm gonna make a movie. I legally don't allow you to. Well, I legally don't give a fuck. Well, I legally will arrest you. Fuck you. Well, I morally don't want you to do that. <laughs> do you think I morally give a fuck? Well, that makes me depressed. Tell online school. If you, if you can tell online school to stop being a bitch, then I will consider it. Damn. You can't talk to your online school. And specifically how online school runs... How about it just doesn't run and we just don't do school? How's about that? I like how schools are still trying to run and it's like very obvious that like... They shouldn't. They shouldn't, yeah. But they're not gonna listen to anyone. Like, yeah, it's nice if a few to give the kids education and all and they kinda have to go to school this year. Like, whether they like it or not, but, like, can't you tell this is not, like, the right time? This, is, this isn't gonna work. Yeah. I get that it's it, not, The problem is, I get that there's it's those not, few like, kids. The school's I get that it's, like, not the school's decision, but, like, it's clearly not gonna work, but, like, the school doesn't get to decide that. Here's the thing, right? Um, if, like, if, if school were to just be, the, the, like, you know the Spanish flu, of course you do. Yeah. Um, and a few other little pandemics, right? For school, they would have it outside. It would keep the spread down, and it would be easier for the students to learn, but they don't, they won't do that. <laughs> Online keeps the spread just haha. Uh -huh, Online it keeps the spread in a bullshit way because we have to do work at home. Mm. But again, the problem is there's those few people who can adapt to online learning and they make everyone else look bad. School's like, they can do it, why can't you? It's because people's minds are different. Mm. That's very true.
people learn differently. And sure, learning at home it can work for some people, but for others, it doesn't. What I just online school just sounds very, very bad. It's because it is. Unless you have that mindset for it, where home is actually an environment you want to work in, which it shouldn't be. Yeah. You shouldn't be sleeping where you do your work. It's, it's honestly just, like, just, it's just, why do online school when you know it's not going to work for mo a lot of people? Well, because you got to get that grade, you know, you know, fuck's sake. Not do, like, literally anything else. At least last year, I would procrastinate, but I would actually get it done. Yeah. This year, I'm just like, oh, I, I'll do it later, and then later comes, and I just don't do it because I'm at home. Yep. <laughs> What's her? What's her? Uh, I hate sneezing. Huh? Cut out. Alright, well, everyone on the podcast, have a good day. If you watch this far, you have no life. Yeah, that's true. We're literally creating this because we can, and you're watching this because you have no life. Literally four hours. Literally nothing to do. Yeah, like four hours. Yeah, you got, you're probably lonely. Far in. You're actually cringe. Like, Viz isn't even here to keep it like lively at this point. So, like, why even bother? Yeah, Viz isn't gonna. Viz isn't gonna be here, so we can't bully anyone. Yeah, but like, unironically, Viz is actually like, does give this podcast life. Yeah. See, we can we can talk for hours, but like, Viz is actually gonna keep shit alive. Yeah, like we're us two. Like, we can talk for hours and make it like. Kind of a podcast, I guess, but like Viz can keep it yeah. actually entertaining. Yeah, but now Viz isn't here because his parents exist or whatever. Yeah, he has to sleep at ten p.m., which is very no. Um, why didn't they let him stay up till ten p.m.? That's kind of cringe. Yeah, it's very cringe, but it's eleven p.m. over here, so I'm going to die. Ah, uh, you're gonna die as per usual. <laughs> I'd imagine mm, you would yeah. whenever it's 10 p.m. Yeah, so I'm I'm probably gonna die. That's epic. If I if I don't die, I'll live. What's insane is I started this recording at five, and I was planning on getting stuff done. And yeah, same I, here. Yeah, I was actually. Like, I was actually planning on recording a verse and stuff, and then I remembered that I'm sick. So logically, I did the... So logically, I did a thing where I have to talk a lot more. Yeah, I don't know what your idea was behind that. It's because I can't... I have it more of... I have an excuse um, for not working on shit. See, I can't really use this as an excuse because my parents don't give a fuck. My parents at least know. My parent at least knows that I'm a YouTuber. I can't tell my mom I'm a YouTuber. She's gonna be like, I don't care. You have to get your fucking work done. And I'm like, yeah, but I can't. Like, literally, I'm just doing this. And my parents are just like, alright. I don't get... No, my mom said she would check my grades every week. Yet she's checking them daily. Yeah. She's not even holding up to her own promise. That's, she would do that. That's like, I was in some boring. weird phase when I was younger, right? Mm -hmm. Where, like, I wouldn't be taking showers when I was supposed to. Mm -hmm. It was it was really weird and pretty, pretty stinky, if I'm to be honest. But 
my mom would remind me every day, and it would ruin the entire purpose of what we were doing. Yep. Like that, I will, uh, totally on that topic. Oh. I was going to say off topic, but no, it's totally on that topic. Parents, some parents just refuse to realize that, like, being so strict and shit just, like, sometimes ruins, especially with school, like, being so strict just sometimes ruins a kid just, like, wanting to do school. Yeah, like, here's, like, they might see school as an escape, but then when you're at home, you have a strict parent as well as school, and that's not going to mix well at all. Yeah. Strict parents, like, some parents just gotta realize that, hey, kids don't like you being strict, and oftentimes it will remove, you th- You see all this stuff, and whatever, and you think, oh, my kid will act this way if I do the same thing, do the same strict thing, and you do it, and surprise, surprise to you, apparently, they're more demotivated now. <laughs> I, I, I kind of get where my parents are coming from. Like, yeah, they know online school is tough, but you can't be failing the entire year. But, like, in the same breath, I have to say, where, what else am I supposed to do? It's it's a situation where I want to do my work, but it's just, like, it, it just doesn't work. Yeah. And I don't need help. Like, I know, I know all this material, but I just don't physically have enough time because... I work, I, I just forcibly work slower. And I work too slow to get all my work done. History. Sure, those assignments don't take that long. But, like, geometry, I took about... Mm, I took an hour and a half to do a lot of my geometry assignments. And then I would have to spend another hour to two hours on ELA. I don't have that kind of time. If I had infinite time, sure, but I don't. Yeah, and that's where I What's the... see parents is like dumb. But whatever, I can just let my mom get pissed at me. I can't do anything about it. I can't. I would like to focus on school, but like, my brain is just so like. Because ADHD and autism, my brain says, haha, fuck you. You get, you get fucking terrible grades because you can't god focus for like a class. And it sucks. Because like, I actually want to work and like want to get good grades, but like, I can't. My parents are talking about how like, you know, flunking ninth grade is apparently motivation to to not. Like, it really isn't. It really isn't. Oh, maybe I shouldn't flunk his ear. Well, too bad, bitch. Negative motivation is not motivation. Yeah, if anything, it puts you into bad habits. Taking my phone... No way, it's not going to help me do my work faster. Yeah. Especially if I improve, right? Because they want me to improve. Especially if I improve this week, but you, you still take my phone away. That's giving me the worst image ever. Of, oh, if I improve, they do this. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. I'm not gonna be able to do anything about it. I'm just gonna keep stalling until I can get back into school and maybe get a grade up. Yeah, it's. It's really just. odd that the. parents decide that's what's good. Because, like, it doesn't make sense to be strict. Yeah, I'm asleep. Apparently getting more sleep helps you do shit faster, so I'm asleep. I mean... Have a good day, podcast people. I don't know, are we yeah. still recording? Uh, yeah. 
Alright, well, have a good day, everyone. Have a good night. I don't care. Fuck you all. Damn. Well, this last few minutes, I guess, is just gonna be me, but, like, um, what I find really insane about just people, like, parents, and, like, just specifically parents, is that they think about, like, they think about with the child that they've, you know, had for, like, ever, you know, the child that has been with them for ever is, like, suddenly, because they're getting bad grades, you think that they think logically, but they just fucking don't, and so in turn, they just decide, hey... It must be this, because it's definitely not because um, of other things, and possibly also because I'm being rude to my own, you know, being very strict and not likable to my own child or anything like that. That would be insane. And, like, strictness of, oh, I'm going to take your device away also doesn't fucking work. Because, like... If anything, it motivates kids less because, like, even if they do better that week, it'll still get taken away. So, like, why even fucking try? Because, you know, it's just gonna get taken away anyways. So, like, why try? Why do anything? Why, why work? Why do all of that when you can literally just fucking sit around and do what's the equivalent of jack shit and get the same punishments? even when you work harder, and that's fucking just insane to me, like, the fact that parents refuse to think about that, like, it's absolutely insane that parents just refuse to think about that type of thing, and just decide, hey, this is a good idea, because nah, and also, schools aren't any better, especially mine, because, like, my school think that, my school thinks that it's good to just take away device when in reality taking away device from ADHD and autistic child just doesn't do shit surprise surprise I know that's an insane concept but like it's an ADHD autistic child that can't focus very well and you're deciding hey guess what we should take the device away because that's clearly the problem and not the fact that we're just blowing off the fact that they're taking what are clearly ADHD and uh, pill, just taking pills to help, you know, them focus better. It's obviously not the fact that they may be ADHD and autistic. No, that couldn't be it because, you know, they're clearly just not focusing. Like, it's absolute bullshit how parent, like, how schools think and how schools and stuff thing because like it's not logical it's not really a whole lot, whole lot of anything and honestly it annoys me it annoys me a lot anyways um um like it's it really just does annoy me um anyways uh that was the podcast um still am sick i hope that i can get better by tomorrow morning because if I don't then blah, that's gonna be cringe because I'll miss another day of school and I don't want to miss it anyways that was the podcast Andy's meme cast um with your host Andy and your co-hosts Encore and Viz who are no longer in call as you can probably tell and our guest equinox um if you enjoyed um leave a like if you didn't enjoy too fucking bad and uh yeah bye